we're back. I'll never look at the numbers Did again. Did you learn your lesson? Yeah, I learned my lesson. Don't look at the numbers. <laughs> you destroyed the stream, dog. You're hubris. Sorry. Welcome. Hey guys, we're back. We're back. Good Adam morning, everyone. Welcome to a new stream. I, I just wanted to look at like our um how much our follower count jumped. That was all. Well, was you shouldn't curious. have. Because you destroyed have. everything. I destroyed everything. You destroyed reality. I think we're close to 14k though. Oh no, everyone's got their toots back. <sighs> everyone's got the toots. Their toots are back again. Thank you very much for the follow. Thank you. Oh, no. The notification no. just went up that we're alive again. Can't believe it's Wednesday already. Here we go, Wednesday stream. It really <laughs> felt like we just finished streaming as Martina well. Martina just said, I see the stream fell apart. <laughs> you will, you left, Martina, you left us. You left us alone. <laughs> we couldn't handle it. The ads are crashing the mobile app. Oh no. I'm really sorry. I hope you guys haven't had to watch ads. Hey. First Lamau free fart. Nice. Yeah, don't worry about stitching the Martina, that's okay. So yeah, do you have any feedback on any of these text bubbles, Mike, now that you have them all in? Because any feedback you have, I'll address now. Um, if you can change the, the color to, what did I do? Uh, this X code, which is... Oh, it's Feb F10. Feb F10. Yeah. Okay. And you want that on all the yellows, right? Yeah, just something that's slightly warmer. Yeah, I'll go with the rest. Okay. Uh, so if you do it on the referee one as well. Yes, no problem. Would you do me a favor then? Yeah. Would you now look through this whole comic? Okay. From start to finish. Okay. Actually read it and let me know if you have any problems with any of the text bubbles. Um, because I'll fix them for you. Hey everyone, it's Massive Void Gap. Oh yeah, at the very beginning. Um, I'm not sure about the red. Is that something you picked from something else? Nope. Just you... What color would you like it to be? Because you sure. can pick one for me and give me a hex code again and I'll change it. I'm not sure. I was generally thinking for stuff like that, you could shift it around in Photoshop and see what you like. Um, but if you find something and you want me to fix it in the original, then I can hex code it. I don't think you need it if you've got the text over the top, honestly. That's my, that's my, that's my two cents. Okay. I've turned um, it off. Cool. Everyone, it's Hero Day at school tomorrow. We get to bring a hero to class. Mr. Sonic, will you do it? Oh man. Sorry, Cream. We're no, <laughs> don't do a Sonic voice. We're out on a mission tomorrow. Why? Okay. Oh man, sorry Cream, we're out on a mission tomorrow. Gotta bop some butts, you know? Everyone's away. Oh, everyone's away? I mean, I'm sure Shadow will be moping around somewhere, but... Mr. Shadow! Wait, oh, uh, thank you Mr. Sonic. He's gonna hate you so much for this. Maybe he'll say yes. 
Well, that's great. I think that's good. I like that. Okay. Do a cream voice, Kappa. <laughs> no. <laughs> I think Amy is slightly brighter. Distracted Senpai. Thank you very much for being here. Have a great day. Um, so. Oh, I think you've done uh, cream socks red there. I think they're meant to be white. Yeah. No. Uh, would you also uh, hoi that up on screen for me? The stream that is. So I can see it. Oh, cool. Yeah. Thanks. And bring yourself back on screen. You foolish bear. I'm foolish bear. Um, no. <laughs> you really think I don't have more important things to do than babysit? No, I, I mean, I'm sorry. Mr. Sonic said, don't worry, sweetie. I guess Sonic just overestimated Shadow's abilities. Mm. Fine. Rouge's chest piece is still color switched under her arm. Oh, here? Yeah. Oh, I see. Thank you. Who made Kareem sad? I'll oh, get him! Let me at him! So if you try and do a Sonic voice, please. Um, long time no see! There you are, that's my Sonic voice. Oh, I should have got a long time no see joke in there somewhere. Never mind. Uh, what is Sonic? Have you... So you're yet to move this, yeah? I've moved it and saved it. Why am I not getting it then? I don't know. Maybe try refreshing your sync tracer. Oh, my sync tracer is dead. That might be why. I'm just going through and saving everything. I was going to do it afterwards, but since you're taking some time to look at your sync tracer, tracer now, I might as well. It's because whenever I think... Have you run out of space again? Yeah, give me a second. Okay, no problem. You think that was pretty good? Thank you. <laughs> that was just loud as swift. <laughs> Damn. It keeps using my C as a scratch disc. Okay. Now do an Eggman voice. No way! I don't believe this! That's my Eggman voice. Get a load of this! 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 I'm not very good. <laughs> Jim Carrey reel! Now imitate Doig saying Sonic. Sonic? Okay, I'm not gonna be able to uh, get this space back until I restart Photoshop, so give me a sec. Mm -hmm. Yeah, no worries. Get a load of piss. Get a load of fish. Imagine if the only person to attend Cream School Meetup was Eggman. She just takes <laughs> Eggman instead. Everyone's like, what have you done? That was one of your ideas, I think, mm -hmm. was, was Eggman. 
Yeah, it was going to be Eggman at camp, but I couldn't think of the reason to have Eggman trying to use cream to find out restoration secrets. Like, it felt too much of a weird plan for Eggman to come up with, which is why it ended up being Allbot and Cubot instead. And then I remembered that the theme of the comics was meant to be Unlikely Duo, so mine technically didn't even fit the theme because it wasn't a duo. <laughs> It was a bunch of kids, including Cream and Allbot and Cubot. Uh, I think it does in that the unlikely duo to be the camp are the robots. I threw so many ideas out though. Like I wanted to do something with Silver, but Silver was already being used by a different artist and writer, so I couldn't. I wanted to use Mighty, but I wasn't allowed to use Mighty because he was part of the classic Sonic canon, not the IDW Sonic canon. So I wasn't allowed. I think I wasn't allowed to use Big either then robotnik didn't fit um i wasn't allowed to do shadow so <laughs> so it ended up being cream and Allbot and cubot i wouldn't have been allowed to use sally uh because again she's not in the idw version yeah i know rota no sally no antoine so it was pretty restrictive i think especially because i was coming on doing this after everyone else had already picked their characters. So I was like, who who is free? Who hasn't been picked? I think I was going to have Mighty and Bark at a carnival playing strength contest against one another. And they were like, you can't use Mighty and you can't use Bark. So it's like, oh, <laughs> oh no. Oh, thanks, Funky Space Alien. This is this pitch is what I wanted to do for that story, but it got rejected. So I'm doing it as a fan comic instead. Well, use Ray. I think you can't use Ray either. If you can't use Mighty, you're going to be able to use Ray. Why can you read the comic? It was in the Sonic Summer Annual. Fang? I don't think you can use Fang either. None of the classic characters, essentially. Okay, it should be better now. Let me Uncle Book, it. do you mean Uncle yeah. Chuck? <laughs> That's another Sat AM character, so no, they don't. They're not in the IDW version. Okay, it should only be using uh, my D drive as scratch disk, so we should be good. Right. I also had a pitch which was going to be Metal Sonic. And, um, oh, what's her name? The little marionette girl. I wonder if this should be. But I wasn't allowed to do that. Belle, yeah, so I had a bunch, as you, as you can tell, I had a bunch of pitches and ideas and uh, I, I wasn't able to do 99% <laughs> of them. Now, Scratch and Ground aren't in this universe either, so you can't use them. Oh, the last Tales tube was all about the cast explaining why they haven't seen Mighty Ray and Fang in ages. That's awesome. What did they say? You mean Uncle Book, the John Candy movie? <laughs> I've never seen that. I don't know what that is. <laughs> you need to see Uncle Buck. Yeah. I wouldn't mind seeing Uncle Book. How about Sonic? I could have used Sonic. I could have used Sonic. But I decided not to because I was like, hey... If it's meant to be unlikely duos, maybe I should use some characters that other people aren't likely to have used. I kind of assumed Sonic would have been taken already, you know? So, is it meant to be updated now? I think so. Because it hasn't still. Has it not? No. Why? Why? You're asking me. Well, what's changed? What have you done? The bottom panel, the uh, fine, isn't over their faces anymore. Easy way to tell. How about Mario? Probably not. <laughs> I'm just guessing. Sonic's in the movie. Oh, Sonic. That's true. But this, the movie universe and the comic universe are separate. So no. Mikkel Moose. <laughs> Who's Mikkel Moose? They basically just said that Mighty and Ray are off adventuring like Sonic and Tails, but maybe they'll cross paths again. I see. Mighty and Ray are like dusting off everyone that's not Eggman. Just use Optimus Prime instead. I should have just used OP. I'm 
I'm sorry, I don't know if it's something that I'm meant to be doing. I got something four minutes ago. I'm going to rescan again. Okay. Let me just check it's saving to the right place. Yeah, it should be in finished PSDs. Okay. Let me just open this. Yeah. Captain. Still there in my in, when I open the PST, that's what's there. Do you but want me to restart? Restart um sync tracer maybe. Okay. Okay, it's starting. It's just putting Willy Wonka. <laughs> like if you won't let me have some of the Sonic characters, then I will instead just put in non-Sonic characters. It could well be that it doesn't think it's changed because you've just moved something and it doesn't think there's a difference. Do you want me to make a new folder and resave them? No. Um. I don't know. I don't know how to resolve it. Because there's either I have to relink them all. I don't. I don't want to just do a just do for that one do a b and i'll set it to that one okay it doesn't seem to be updating any of them though so should i do that to all of them <sighs> that means i have to relink all of them so i don't know i should the whole point was this would just auto update well let's instead just go through and get the rest of your notes so i've moved that okay This one's great. I think this one's really good. Yeah, you'll be able to see the DNA of uh, Hero Camp in this story, Hero Day. Because <laughs> it's got a very similar structure. Uh, good morning, students, and welcome to our very special guests. Why don't we kick off this morning by having our heroes come forward and tell us what they do? I think that one's perfect. Howdy, kids. Mr. Tufts here. I'm a plumber. Hi, I'm Sanders. I'm a writer. I'm Shadow, the ultimate life form. <laughs> I was sent here to destroy humanity, or so I thought. After some soul-searching, I realized my best friend's dying wish was for me to instead bring happiness. So ever since, I've been fighting the forces of darkness, both without and within. Uh, why don't we move on to the, <laughs> on to the day's activities? Cool, yeah. I think that works, yeah, because she doesn't really change. Although she does is looking at him, so it's a shame we miss miss her. That's okay. Like we miss this. Yeah, that's not a big deal though. There's nowhere else for me to put that speech box. Yeah. Like you could just be like um, but yeah, I think this moves it forward and then when you yeah, go to the does. next page, it's good. Yeah, we say move on to a day's activities and the next page is the day's activities. So. Yeah. How is everyone's macaroni, macaroni art coming along? That's a nice, <laughs> that's a nice horse shadow. Horse! This is a mighty bio lizard. I depicted him shooting energy beams and into space while the space colony arc looms above. Ooh, I like the colors. Thank you. I did some colors for you. Thank you. <laughs> ah, of course. And what have you made, Cream? Super Shadow. I use glitter for his special chaos powers. He saved the world and all of his friends are cheering him on. <laughs> so good. So good. Oh, that's so cute. All right, everyone. I want to see some good, clean fun. This one still needs some color. Yeah, it needs a bit it. of work. But he's bamfing. <laughs> Playtime is over. Chaos sphere. <laughs> bap, bap. Whoa. <laughs> what? Yeah, I think that totally works.
What's this? The last minute, the, the yellow team are making a last minute comeback. Can they turn this around? Bonk. And they've done it in a stunning victory. Yellow team wins. We did it. Smug. Yeah, I think that all works. The flow is good. A nice use of the negative space that you were worried about. Story time. And their, then their fairy godmother whisked them from danger. Hmm. This isn't like any fight I've ever seen. How is it like with the restoration something? <laughs> you should just leave freedom fighters, honestly. If well, you, that's what you grew up with. I've changed it, called. so it's okay. fine. Yeah, tell us. Does your shoes really rock it? <laughs> Ten minutes later. There we were. Trapped between Oblivion and Eggman's endless army. That's when I used chaos control. Whoa, so cool. Yeah. Yep, that's all That's all feeling great. It's readable. And it's like, I didn't have any struggles with placement and everything. I love him. Love him a lot. Awesome. You would not know who the restoration is if not for chat. Yeah. There's a couple of changes I might make to the script. I might change this. There's a couple of points I think I could make more clearly. So I'm going to do that. What if this one's like, what's it like fighting with Sonic sh um, Shadow or Sonic, Sonic and the other Shadow? Yeah. And then it's very explicit. Yeah, I could do something like that. Because that feels like more what a kid would say. What does it feel like punching bad guys? Yeah, exactly. That's basically what they're asking, right? Yeah. Um, it's like, not so much what's it like being part of the restoration, but like, what's it like to fight with all the heroes? How would you phrase yeah. that? Fighting with Sonic, <laughs> which is kind of double entendre because it's like That's fighting. I don't want it to be misunderstood by people. Okay. Like, I don't want people to think that they're asking. What's it like to be fighting against Sonic all mm -hmm. the time? Today was the best. Thanks so much for coming. Don't mention it. <laughs> no, really. Don't. You really are an amazing hero, Mr. Shadow. Aww. And then 10. I feel like we get here and the soft bloom is like sudden. So I'm gonna... I'm gonna calm that down a lot. Can you think of something cute for uh, Cream to say when they win? win? Other than we did it. Yeah. Get fucked. <laughs> um. Yay! Wahoo! Take Mario's catchphrases. <laughs> um. We survived. We survived. Great teamwork. Huzzah, whoopee. We did it. Seems pretty good. Like, because that emphasizes her feeling that it was both of them together. Yeah, like, we won. I think the use of we is really good. Like, just because it feels like they're just repeating information, like, the ref says, and they've done it, and she says, we did it. And if I have a say, we won, then it's like, the other team wins, we won. Right. Hmm. Well, how about you just remove... Whoopee or yippee could be fun. Maybe just remove the ref and then just put all the emphasis on her... That, like you just have this panel of like the space of everyone getting taken out and then just we did it if you feel like it's a double beat i think it's more important for cream and shadow to recognize their accomplishment than someone else to do it i think yellow team wins is important to say personally okay but um Imagine. So that you know that the match is over. Yeah. Okay. 
but I'm going to take out in a stunning victory and just have yellow team wins. Dead. And then I might change her thing to like a yippee or something. I don't know, I'm still thinking. Tough, it's a tough call. Our vote suggests, how about a stunning victory for the yellow team? <laughs> Smug shadow showing his child is better than yours is growing on you, says Derp's Matt. Growing on them, says Derp's Matt. <laughs> That's good. That's <laughs> good. I chose the right one. I, can't, I like the simplicity of yellow team wins. I think I'm going to keep that. Or maybe remove and they've done it. And then in a stunning victory, your team wins. We did it. So you don't have the double beat of they've done it, they've did it. Maybe. It's kind of um cream's line that I want to adjust though. Okay. Currently. Pabro suggests, and that's game. And that's game is a good idea. You solved my problem. You solved my lettering puzzle. Great job. Thank you for the suggestions, everybody. Okay, so I preferred that. And now I'm changing the library one a little bit. Okay, I'm gonna go color page six. That sounded like this should update. Yeah. Oh, it's got a little thing. Update modified content. There we go. So, and that's game. Yellow team wins. We did it. Yeah, I think, that, I think that's great. can actually hear the music.
I get a little indicator if you've made an update now. Oh, well, that's cool. Yeah, I think that's nicer. Two still hasn't updated though, weirdly. Let me try resaving it again. Okay, I've just saved two again. So let's see if that works. Okay. <clears throat> that sounds promising. Awesome. Yep, yeah, there it goes. Yeah, that feels better. There we are. So I've resaved a bunch of them. I've made a few adjustments to the script. So hopefully that feels good. So I've changed that to and a warm welcome to our very special guests. Oh, it just changed. Yeah. yeah. Do you like that? Yeah. Okay. So if you go to page three, three. four, <laughs> that's all the same. Um, and I've changed what Cream says. He saved the world and all of his friends are cheering him on. The one before that. <laughs> Super Shadow, I use gold glitter because he's so powerful. Instead of saying his chaos powers and stuff. Yeah, I changed it to something which was more personal to Cream. So she's saying here that she thinks he's super powerful rather than he has chaos powers and so that's what the glitter is. Okay. It's he's so powerful I used gold glitter. So it's more of a compliment. Yeah. I like that. Yeah. Would cause have like a little apostrophe? Yeah, I can do that. This is page five. Let me just adjust that now. Are you like the Overhead shot with shadow of the windows frames. Yeah, I like, I like this. There, that's saved. I've saved, I've saved over f that one now, so it should update. That was weird. Is that a baby dog? It is! What the fuck? Why did it... Is it because I've updated the text layer and it's trying to do something? Maybe. 
Maybe let it update the text layer first. That isn't actually that bad anyway. So could you trim her hair out of the top of that? Yeah. Thanks. Let's get scratching. Thank you very much for the follow. Papa Do Doig is already filmed with the wrong glasses. Thank you, Ad Potato. Papa Doig. Papa Doig. Papa Doig. I'd order from that pizzeria. Me too. I'm glad I didn't spend any time on all the, st all the stuff that was on her table, like the glue and pencils and stuff. Yeah, it's completely under the speech rule. Yeah. Would you mind um, colouring in the earth, though, on her painting? And the friends, because otherwise you can't see what she's describing. Yeah, no, that's fine. I'm just going to do that. Uh... Litter. The glitter is probably a bit much anyway. You think? That I put on afterwards, yeah. She's probably gonna do it with like this sort of thing. She'll probably make it look more like the planet. What's it meant to be? Earth. Yeah, or their world, whatever that may be. Tell me again who these characters are. This is Blaze, yeah? That's Blaze. She'd be like... Purple. Yeah. You like the mental image of Doig ordering pizza from himself? If he could, he would. This is Rouge. Yeah. That's, that's cream. Okay. What do you think of this crawling style for it or is this not cool? What do you think of this colouring style for it, or is it too messy? I think it's okay. I think it might be hard to see far away though. It is harder to see, yeah. Because uh, people aren't probably aren't going to be able to see the individual strokes. Probably. I tried it.
And then the last one is a robot. Let me tell you what colour they are. IDW wiki. Do they have a little windmill hat? No. I, I figured they probably had like a little thing on the side of the head. Okay, it's E123 Omega and they have a yellow head. And a little uh, grey slot where their eyes are. Like in between their eyes. because I've saved the text layer again. I think it's just, I've got a lot of stuff going on. There. There they are. Nice. Thank you. He's super shadow. He's super shadow. Razvanay says, Doig Swift, I must tell you, I had a dream I ended a home full of Sonic plushies. I'm putting all the blame on you guys. I'll take that blame. Happily. School Power Mike says that the parts overlapping the drawing helped to sell it as a kid's drawing. Like the parts overlapping the lines. Yeah. Beautiful. <laughs> yeah and then if you refresh my text again i've changed it to rainbow glitter so it matches your drawing oh. i like the choice to use rainbow glitter that's that is what glitter is there's no other colors of glitter <laughs> yeah you can't just buy a color of glitter what are you Insane? Hi Void Android! Turns out the internet was breaking so you're back. Oh no. I feel like, okay, so I put this white here yeah. for, for Shadow's eyes, but I don't like it. I like it. Oh, you like it. Okay, it makes cool. it look like Shadow. Okay. Is the teacher lady a sheep? Kind of. She's like, I was thinking more goat. I think she looks more like a sheep, but I was going with goat. Should, I mean, she's got felt tips and stuff, right? Yeah. She, would she have drawn onto the macaroni like no. those red spikes? I think keep it as it is. Okay. Um, so it's very obviously macaroni. Macaroni, yeah. Okay. Why Shadow in preschool? He was pressured to come here by Rouge. He had to retake a year. <laughs> he decided to learn to read. <laughs> You're wondering about cow. Cow would actually work as well, I think. She's got like a goat tail. <laughs> See what you do. You might need to uh, multiply it, get it in the right place and then erase around where the gray is.
Use your arrow tools, you heathen. I know, he says, that's actually my nightmare, having to go back to school after becoming an adult. Yeah. Kids are scary and cool. And they'd eat me for breakfast. I wouldn't survive. They're too brutal. School was awful, yeah. I had an okay time at junior school, but I did not have a good time at high school. Yeah. I think uh, arrays first where the edges and then you can lock the transparency and use your grey all you want. Okay. Hmm. I'd hate to hang around preteens again. I, I'm scared of, of like teens though, like 14 to 18 year olds. I feel like they can be really mean. Arty 14 to 18 year olds are great, but other 14 to 18 year olds are mean or can be mean. Kids with their memes now and TikToks and their YouTube shorts, Thor. <laughs> <laughs> and that their Thor. YouTube shorts, what, Thor. What a rowdy teen he is. You think middle school is the worst, everything above is fine? Aw, Renee, I, I don't know if that's true. I don't know if they should want to be like. <laughs> Horribly disorganized and terrible at time management. Although I think we time managed the heck out of this project. I think we didn't have time to manage our time. I think uh, we wouldn't have survived if we hadn't managed our time in this project. You want to be like me when you throw up? <laughs> yeah, I mean, it's true, a hot mess. Who says they want to be like? It always fucking ages me 10 years every time I learn how old Renee is. How old's Renee? Like 12? Yeah. <laughs> I would guess like 26? We've known her since she was a baby. All you did was this project, yeah. Spot on, I knew it. I knew it because my instinct was to do 24. <laughs> And then I was like, but it's been a couple of years since I've hung out properly with Renee. So my memory of her is probably two years out. So I'm gonna go two years up. Nailed it. I hope we get to hang out again soon. Now that I have less work, I can come into your server and frump around. It's close enough. It's, it's perfectly close. That's absolutely spot on, my dude. This is what he loves. This is what he loves. <laughs> Save. Was I a theater kid? You, you don't dude, know me. <laughs> you don't even fucking know. You don't know me. Don't you, don't you act like you Let know me? Was she a theater kid? Listen. Ah. Were her parents theater kids? I, come I don't from know. Long life. <laughs> oh. Okay, so India's parents, one of them was like, um, like they were both kind of in set design, art direction, and theater for years. Uh, every theater season, they would have people that like stayed with them during the theater season. Watches. So Lodgers, so Swifty grew up with actual theater people. This isn't, this isn't 
she was she was in a play in high school theater kid level. This was she was practically raised by the theater kid level. I ran away and joined the theater. <laughs> the theater. Yeah, my are you a are, theater kid? My parents are set designers and theater designers. Or they were when they had me. They since changed profession. My dad became a boat builder and my mum became a writer. A school parent bike says I wanted to be a theater kid, but all of the theater kids at my school were way too serious and pretentious and I couldn't vibe with them. That's fair. I'm just a theater kid, the theater kid, the original. <laughs> the source of all theater kids. I wish I was more of a theater kid though. For a theater kid, I haven't been in the theater much. I'd like to do more plays and do more acting. Dude, you, you've done plenty of theater <laughs> right here. Is, it, is this what this is? This has just been a live you, theater show the whole time. Every day. Glim yeah. on stage. Glim on stage. Oh my gosh. I need a giant, I need a giant Glim mascot costume for someone to do ballet in. Yeah, they should all have updated though, if you want to update the um, the text layers, it should not be that yellow anymore. I'm going to stop you from fiddling and take care of the text first, because if you're going to fiddle, you can put hours on the clock. Okay. Yeah, you should be. Now it's my turn to crack the whip. There yeah. we go. Okay, so can you go through the pages again? Because a couple of them have changed. I need to check. Okay, so that one should still be the same. Yep. That, that one changed. has changed and you've changed it. Yep. That one's changed and you've changed it. Do you want to check? Yeah, that one's changed. I changed it to I'm the ultimate life form instead of the ultimate life form because it went along with the cadence of the others more. I'm a plumber, I'm a writer, I'm the ultimate life form. What was it before? The ultimate life form. Just I'm shadow, full stop. The ultimate life that form. That was funnier. That was funnier. Hi, the kids. Mr. Tufts here. I'm a plumber. Hi, I'm Sanders. I'm a writer. I'm Shadow, I'm the ultimate life form. I think breaking the pattern and just being like, I'm Shadow, the ultimate life form was funnier. Okay. <laughs> I'm Shadow, a life form. A life form. Yeah. Okay. That's uh, changed and saved and it should come in in a second and you can change it back. There you go. Change on your own. You're Is bastard. it meant to? Sometimes it does, sometimes it doesn't. There you go. I'm Shadow. The yeah, that, that for me is just f way funnier. Okay. I'm Shadow, the ultimate life form. Okay. So next page. So I've changed this and you've updated it. Okay. So it looks like that's been updated. Yep. Uh, that one looks like it's been updated too and that's game. Yep. That just updated. That just itself. updated there. So that, so now how is it like fighting the bad guys shadow? I changed it too. How is it like fighting the bad guy, Shadow? Yeah, tell her. Does your shoes really rock it? So I think that reads really good. Yeah, now it's less about Sonic. It's less about the restoration. It's just about fighting the bad guys. 
<laughs> You're glad to see the peak of evolution is a hedgehog edge lord. <laughs> oh, and I changed. You mean the, a hedge lord? Ha! Huh? I changed the bottom text as well. So now they say, "Whoa, so cool!" And then a kid says, "Best story ever." That's really nice. So it's I like, like that. this is the best story time they've had, basically. Yeah, he's he's breaking breaking their little minds. Yeah, I think Shadow's muzzle there might be too dark. By the way, here. Yeah. Okay. He's just all in shadow and dramatic. It's hard to do shadow in shadow because he's got such dark gray fur anyway. Figure it out. Yeah. What about here? Is that okay? That looks great. I think it's easier to see because it's bigger. Yeah. That he's got a shadow on him. Okay. I will I will amend that. Miss Sugar Pop says the fact that you can work on the same project at the same time like that isn't mind blown. It's all thanks to getting sync trays set up between our computers. Uh, this is still yellow. Oh, okay. Let me double check that. This is this is changed back before our eyes. Hang on. Whoa! What the heck? Update all modified content. There we go. Okay, there we go. <laughs> cool. Yeah. Okay, so that's changed. Oh, and I was going to ask you to please color in a uh, creamed nose brown. Here. Yeah. Just because it looks a little weird to me white. You're weird to me white. Do, 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 do. There is a Sega game with a boss called Zodic the Hellhog. Which game is it? Can one of the books have a mini Twitch logo to reference us? <laughs> I've I've put a little thank you to Twitch chat in the beginning. If that helps. Okay, next page. Uh I think that's all the same. There you are, handsome. I don't know about the handsome line, even if it is Ruji. It's what she calls him. So it's like, if I want to adopt the IDW slang and have them have that same relationship, then that's what she calls Shadow. Like she does also just call him Shadow, but yeah, there you are. Shadow doesn't feel, just feels like, blah, blah, blah. but yeah, like, it's very rude. Exactly. Yeah. Um. Like. Okay. I think it might read weird to people who don't read the IDW, but to people who do, I think they'll just be like, yes, that's what Rouge calls Shadow. Yeah. Dangtown Bunny says, could you use GitHub for our projects like this, or is it an art equivalent? I think usually we just use Dropbox or yeah, Google Drive. But while streaming Dropbox, you have to like, while streaming, it Dropbox has to like go out to a server and come back. Whereas what we're using now is uh, just local to our Wi-Fi, so it, we don't have to put it out on the upload download. Thing. Yeah, we used to use Dropbox on stream and it would tank our stream connection and crash the stream. Yeah. Or at least make the bitrate really, really slow. I think that's everything. I think there's one thing I'm noticing which is weird, which is that the tail seems to go into like, E. So when we're zoomed out, it's just this weird E tangent thing. You want me to just here. adjust that tail? Yeah, I just put it below bike, I think. Okay. I love how invested Rouge is. Yeah. Well, I think she kind of wanted. I think she just wanted Shadow to have a little bit of fun. Yeah. Like she's not super invested, but like she does, she is friends with him, so she doesn't want him to be like sad all the time. Okay, that's adjusted. Thanks. Wow, yeah, it doesn't like me doing that while it's well, edited content. Huh? Is that what it is? 
Yeah, that's better, I think. Your brain to say that the magazine Shadow is reading is just called Edge. I mean, there is a game magazine called Edge. Yeah, that's true. I used to read that magazine. Yeah, I feel like the colors are pretty much there on certain pages. There's just, uh, I think, so the, the one mood here needs improved. Could you cut off the top of Shadow there? Oh, um, you want him cut off? Yeah. Not in not in that one. Not, not in, this in one. Yeah, this in the, one. yeah. Okay, I was going to say. Are we also British? Yes, we are. Guess. we also yeah. British? We're a resident of the UK. As it happens, <laughs> fellow Brits unite. No! <laughs> you have cream say there by the way dog yeah yeah i think that's just really nice you changed it from being like you're the best hero just to today was the best thank you so much for coming i think that's really nice like that's a that's a genuine sincere kind of thing and he's just like you know don't mention it it's nice I like that. He gave her a really nice day. <laughs> Vanilla best mom's like, what are you doing with him? <laughs> <laughs> you really are an amazing hero, Mr. Shadow. It's, oh, man, you just like, tugging on some heartstrings with this page. I feel like, you had a certain mood here where he's backlit and she's frontlit, so I'm gonna need to. You've got the thumbs, right? Yeah. Top 10 hottest female Sonic characters. Oh no! <laughs> no! She's a. Uh, she was doomed from the beginning, having more humanoid proportions than being a rabbit. Pokemon knows. You thought it worked, Harry Manning was part of the comic for a moment. It just gets suddenly really, like, meta. It's like, shouldn't you be working? Yeah, did you get the thumbs okay? Yeah, I did. So for the ones where you were saying that you feel like they're pretty, you're pretty happy with them. Mm -hmm. Could you save those into a final tweaks folder for me? You'll still be able to work on them. They're just the only files that I'll go into and make my little artwork tweaks on because they'll be super close to final. Yeah, so what, when you say I will still be able to work on them. Yeah. 
like I'll work on them in the colors one. How would we get your changes? You would work on the ones that you saved in there as well, but okay. you just wouldn't until I've told you I finished doing my changes to them. Okay, I see. I see. You're basically hands off those until I give you the go ahead. But after that, you can keep on tweaking if you want. Gotcha. So did I decide not to put cheese in this? Yeah, I did. I essentially decided that she probably wouldn't take cheese to school because that would just add in another character to have to worry about. So, you know, I did consider having cheese there when she got picked up by her mum at the end. But as far as my head cannon goes, cheese is at home. And as far as IDW canon goes, cheese isn't there anymore. Cheese would probably get locked in the teacher's desk. No! What ones do you need to do tweaks to, or do you not know until you see them? Uh, all the ones that you told me you've missed this, or you need to add that, or this is backwards. Okay. All of those. Yeah, I don't know if you guys have been reading IDW, but uh, there was this thing called a metal virus where there was a whole arc about this virus that Eggman had created that could turn people into robots. And Cheese got roboted. Cheese is being looked after by other robots. Did he survive that? <laughs> he survived. Did he? <laughs> really? Where is he? Omo Chow 2.0. If she survived that, I completely forgot she survived that. I'm a bad Sonic fan. Oh no. Oh no. Potatoes Games Official, thank you so much for the raid. Hello. Hello. Welcome. You recall him showing up in the side server of the latest issue? Well, I'm just talking shit. <laughs> yeah, he did turn at some point, but I guess they saved him, so it's fine. Oh, wait, yeah, because at the end of the arc, everyone gets saved, right? <laughs> That's not just still metal virus people wandering around. Hmm. Oh, yeah, I'd forgotten about that. Ah, well, he's at home. He's at home. Forget everything else I said. I like cheese. I don't want cheese to die. I like cheese. I just never really see him in the comics that much. So I think my brain was like, oh, it was a metal virus, right? That must be why. So, Doik, I know that you are doing this. Mm -hmm. Would you mind saving the files that you currently consider complete? For okay. Me? How how about this? Uh, you 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 grab them from the file folder. Why don't so you just say, save the ones that you're happy with? Because that takes me time, and you may as well like they're all saved in there. So I have to open them while you have them. You could save as and just put them in a new folder. Okay. Uh, so I would say one, two, three. One, two, three, seven, eight, ten. One, two, three, seven, eight, ten.
Peter Steve says, I just saw Tom from Tom and Jerry get so scared his skeleton jumps out and his skeleton turns his head to see a dog with bones on the eyes and runs. <laughs> okay. Man, I love Tom and Jerry. It's great. Okay, there's a folder called fixes. Um, one, two, three, seven, eight, ten. Thank you. Which means I can touch six, nine, four, five. You can touch any of the ones you want because you are working. Oh no, wait, yeah, hold off those ones. You're right. Cool, I have them. Thank you. I'm gonna go to the bathroom. Okay, you so do that. You take the screen, yeah? Uh, give me a sec just okay. to get the stuff that you just uh, did open. Ba 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 ba. Okay, yep. Yeah. Yeah, I was just looking for... It's okay, I'll, I'll let you do the colour fixes and I'll just stick to the drawing fixes. It's like this flower overlapping into here and this part of Tangle's tail being coloured Amy's. Mm. I don't know how to get to it. Can't seem to find the right layer. So, yeah, I'll let you do it. And I'll focus on Cream's leaflet. So you can give me the screen now if you want. Tom and Jerry, that's cool. Oh, Corrupt 3D. Doug, your Scottish right thoughts on Iron Brew. Doug is left, but I can tell you that he loves Iron Brew. He adores Iron Brew. Dynamics, pen pressure. Oh no, is my pen pressure not working? It should be. It is working. I don't know why it's telling me it's not. Zero to hero. Oh yeah, if you want, tell me your Twitter at. I'm at old Swifty. Are you okay? Side big and deep. I don't tell Doig I rescaled something. What did you rescale? My own writing just now for Hero Day. But it's not a factor. I don't care about that. 
doesn't care. Careful, you're not. I suppose they're going to be bleed added, maybe. Or well, not. I certainly I hope know. so. Uh, because otherwise, things are going to be much too close to the edge. Yeah. What do you think? Something like that? Yeah, is red too violent? What would you rather it be? A light blue, maybe? Light blue. Okay. Like that? Something like that, or you maybe yellow. Yeah, like cream is tie, maybe? Room's tie. Yeah. Yeah. Just red just felt like murder day. It's murder day at school tomorrow. Where's Shadow? Music's cool. I don't think that's quite working. go hero day 
little red boss that just got here and there's a school in the Sonic universe? Well, there is now. <laughs> I've decided. Yeah, yeah. That's Tangle's tail. It goes for a long time. Sonic Schoolhouse 2. This could be the same schoolhouse. Who knows? I may have stolen some architecture from Sonic Schoolhouse. Okay, so now's the time where we get to decide what's on her leaflet. Maybe it's like... You're welcome to show your art. Thank you for asking. Over here, I'll give you some pets. No, not one. Come on. What is it you're after? Are you out of dry food or something? You need help. Blink twice. You need help. <laughs> Or did you just want to wait till I started doing something so you could come in and yell? Gonna retire now so much good art. Let's have a look. Miss Chuckapot Radical, thank you to meet Heather the goat. She punched and rams people. <gasps> oh, that's so <gasps> cute. She looks great. Beautiful artwork. Really gorgeous. I love the texture on that piece. Really, really cool looking character. What's she for? Are you gonna make some kind of fighting game or is she for a comic or? Who is my hero? Sonic the Hedgehog. <laughs> oh, you see his link deleted, really? Hold on. On Miss Sugar Pop's thing, because I can see it. Thanks, Peter Steves. Peter Steves says, I like how you handwrite things. It's so hard to like type things and then make it look good by deforming it onto paper. Oh, it was a Sonic character for a Sonic D&D one shot. <gasps> I want that to happen to me. Was she fun to play as? Thank you, pals. There it is. I'll grab it. There you go. Look how cool. He looks great. I'm guessing a monk then. Yeah, are the Sonic RPG rules available? Because I would like to play. Should 
She was very cool. She was four elements monk and she caught arrows out of the air. That's radical. Damn, she looks great. Let me pop her over here. There you go. <laughs> I know he says I didn't have a Sonic OC, but then I played Sonic Forces. So now I have a Sonic OC, I guess. What's your Sonic OC like with Ionoki? You got the crazy eyes. Yeah, which, <laughs> what's your character like? During Sonic Symphony, they fucking used the most insane looking character um, for their Frontiers, like, footage that they played behind the thing. Yeah, I'm so happy that they decided uh, to use the most unhinged looking character possible for the footage behind the songs that they were playing from the game. it from what we already know like bring your hero in to let's learn together or something leave it to let's learn together that's it'll be fine i'll put an indication of some more writing down here
Okay. Corrupt 3D says, I heard you mentioned anime hours ago, Swift. What animes have you watched? Oh, a lot. <laughs> a lot of them. But my favourites are Neon Genesis Evangelion. Darker Than Black. Full Metal Alchemist. I always really liked Last I Exile. I thought that was awesome. Cowboy Bebop is up there. Not to be cliche. Full Metal Alchemist and Full Metal Alchemist Brotherhood both. I prefer the ending of Full Metal Alchemist Brotherhood, but I prefer the setup of Full Metal Alchemist. Because I think the early episodes hit harder in the original series. But that's just me. That is only me. What anime do I really like? I feel like there is some that I'm just missing and forgetting. Ah oh well. No spoilers for the animes mentioned. Okay, no problem. Anime, hello! Yes, we're talking about you. Oh, um, of course, uh, Hands Off Isaacan was so good. Mm -hmm. It's beautiful. All the uh, Ghibli films, but especially Laputa, Castle in the Sky, and The Castle of Cagliostro. What do I think is my favorite cartoon or anime? Maybe Avatar The Last Airbender. I know, again, I know it's a popular answer, but it's just good. It's just good. Like, what can I say? The storytelling's really good, the characters are really good, the fighting's really good. Like, it's just good. Your favourite is probably Pink Panther or Tom and Jerry. Yeah, I love Tom and Jerry. I love the Looney Tunes. So amazing. Yeah, I've watched Beastars and One Punch Man too. I liked both of those. You finally watched Avatar about a year ago and you finally get how people love it. Yeah, it's great, isn't it? It's... It's really good. Like, I worry sometimes that because people have probably heard so much about it, that it might be overhyped for people. But I think the important thing to know about it, if you want to go into it and haven't seen it before, is that you're not necessarily going to be mind blown by the first couple of episodes, but it's just a really good story with really good characters. Like, it's just good. And it really rarely lets you down. You're excited to see the new Ghibli? Me too. <laughs> Hannah Barbera is probably your favorite studio and then Warner Brothers. Yeah, yeah, I think Warner Brothers is probably my favorite. I love Bugs Bunny and Daffy Duck. They're so funny. They're especially Daffy, Daffy's my favorite. And I love Sylvester and Tweety as well. And the Roadrunner and the Coyote. Gravity Falls was really good. I'm watching his little face as requested. Yeah, Gravity Falls was good. There were a couple of ones which I think they didn't get the recognition they deserved, which were really good. I think The Misadventures of Flapjack. The Marvelous Misadventures of Flapjack was really good and I think Wonder of Yonder was really good and I think both those shows didn't get the recognition they deserved. So if you haven't seen those, I recommend them. They both have similarly unhinged energy. 
but they're very fun. How does this feel? Yeah, I, I worked on specifically the opening of Amphibia. Which is very fun. I was going to take a boarding test for it, but I had too much other stuff on, so I didn't. Were you asking me how this looks, Stoig? Yeah. Take the screen. It looks great. I love that. Cool. You speak of a celebrity. I wouldn't call myself a celebrity. Definitely not. But I did do like two shots on the opening and that's it. Matt Braley tweeted about your comic. Matt Braley tweeted about my comic? Yeah. What? Do you not remember that? Okay, yeah, Matt Braley was oh, like- Oh, about Girl in the Glim? Yeah. I thought you meant about this. <laughs> no. <laughs> yeah, How he was did. he meant to know about this? He did, yeah, he was really kind. He was like, he basically shouted us out and said that people should go and check out our comic, which was so nice. I've injured really like Slime Brigade. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> wow, Dagtown Buddy, thanks. <laughs> wow, yeah, did you guys see that? It was pretty good, right? It's pretty good. <laughs> Hi, Lurking Yoshi. Nice to meet you too. Hello. Is that why you bought the book in the first place? Because of Matt Braley? Aww. He's such a nice dude. I really hope that one day I get to meet him in person and I can say thank you very much for that and for contacting me about Amphibia. Like, yeah. what a nice dude. Your, your, your history with Amphibia was you, you worked with a company to do a test to try and get animation, animation on the opening. Didn't get the pitch. No, we Got on the entire show. Oh, was it the entire show? Yeah, I was. I did some animation for a company who wanted to try and get the show. Oh, I thought you were just trying to get the opening. No, they were trying to get the whole show. Wow. And I think we didn't get it, but I did the animation test for that. And then Mike Braley contacted me to ask me if I wanted to apply as a storyboard artist on it. And I said, I'm really sorry, I don't think I have time. And then Yota contacted me to ask if I wanted to animate on the opening. So I was like, yes, finally the project has come back to me. Okay, there we go. But I think I only need to indicate on the first two. It not seem like it, but this bird over here, she's a pretty big deal. No, I'm not. She be quiet. I'm really not. There are so many people who've worked on so much more than You'll me. You'll see. I'm really small fry when it comes You'll to the world of animation. See. You went to see Twerp live back in September. That's awesome. They're so good live, right? What have you worked on? List everything and we'll judge. Jeez, oh. I'm gonna forget stuff. If you really wanna know. I worked on, I'm just gonna go from when I got hired as an animator because before then I worked on some really small niche stuff and it'd be really fun if someone from chat knew it but i think the likelihood is no one will so i'm not gonna bother <laughs> um wonder over yonder was my first job then i worked a little bit on it was like a dorothy of oz cartoon from the same studio um i did a little bit of danger mouse while i was there as well then i left and made girl in the glim and started a youtube channel with my best friend and partner, Mike. Who are you? Who are you? Where I did, I participated in stuff like the Grumps variations and animate a Grump. And I did some animations for things like um, Night in the Woods as a fan, fan animations for those things. I did a fan animation for the Adventure Zone. Um, then I met Patrick and we decided to work together and we, boarded Night Runner Mike and Bullets together with Patrick as a director and then I animated on that and then he said 
I should direct something. So I directed Starlight Brigade and animated and boarded on that. We also did the Heartboner music video together. And then I did the Mystic Crystal music video with Knights as well. And then from there, I boarded on the rise of the TMNT movie. Uh, which was amazing, which is where I met JJ and Kevin. And then JJ pulled me onto Transformers Earthspark with him. And between all that, I was freelancing by also continuing working on Glim for the next part of that. I did some Knuckles Divergence. I did trailer for game that will remain unnamed as it has not yet come out or been announced. And so when that trailer comes out, I can say, hey, I boarded that, but until it does, I can't. Um, I think, is that everything, Mike? Where did you get up to? I got up to Transformers Earthspark. Mm -hmm. Then from Transformers Earthspark, I left to work on Redacted, which I cannot talk about uh, right now, but I will talk about when Redacted is at a point where I can talk about it. Mm -hmm. I think that's it. There's two Redacteds that you can't talk about. Are there? Yeah. The two latest it's things one, that you worked one, on. The game trailer. No. Okay. The series. Oh yes. There you uh, go. And I've also been I've been boarding on a series for the past nine months that I chose to step away from because I wanted to do personal work. So I also can't talk about that until that's out. It's technically been announced, but we still haven't got the all clear to say that we're involved in it, so I still can't say anything. And that's it. Yeah, Corrupt3D says, wait, 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 our boy Doig isn't getting the love he deserves. Let Doig say what he's worked on. Uh, I worked on... Um, when India mentioned the Knights of Light Table videos, I worked on Starlight Brigade, Mr. Crystal, um and Magnum Bullets. I also worked on the um, Blowing the Payload one uh, that India didn't work on. Ha ha ha. I wasn't involved in that one at all. Uh, we also worked on the trailer for Spiritfarer. She missed that one out. Oh, I did miss that one. Oops. Yeah, uh, we, worked, we did the Spirit trailer. We did Spiritfarer trailer, which was actually done by a separate team at night's. But um, there were some notes that were needed from the company and the team had already left. So David and Patrick and I and Mike all jumped into it and finished the trailer off. So a lot of what made it into the final trailer was us either refining things or redoing a few things. Uh, worked on a short film for Kazazi Moto that was released as part of an anthology on Disney Plus. I worked on the that's the I think it's episode two, Makuzi the Spirit Racer. So he was art uh, director on that. Yeah. Um what else? I worked on some um, games with some friends way back when. Uh I worked on a game that was unreleased at Sega at one point. Oh yeah, I worked on Sonic Dash. Oh yeah, yeah. And you also worked on Sonic Dash. I also did some Rise fan animations. Hello. Just for funsies. Uh, that got pretty popular on Twitter, I think. Or somewhere. Somewhere they got some views. I don't know. And now I really think that's it. I think. We might have missed a little bit. It's fine. Oh, I did some boards for Brown Bag in Manchester. Oh, uh, yeah. For, for uh, some yeah. musical shorts based around Vampirina, I think. Yeah, I think so. I boarded the mummy wrap. That was the first 
board I ever did professionally. Before even I worked at night. I didn't know what the fuck I was doing. <laughs> you wanted to work for Brown Bag? Oh, they're cool people. They were really nice. They're the people who came up to us at Thought Bubble and introduced themselves and bought books from us. And it was really nice. We all got to chat together and talk about work. You remember the day that Pratt Bros did an animation analysis of the Rise movie? It's so good, right? Flying Bark animated it and they are just the absolute fucking best animation studio in the world. So yeah, there's that theatre kick coming out. Yeah, so that's that's it. And of course, just there's just like silly side projects that I do for fun. They're not work though. Like the stuff like Brooklyn Nine-Nine Sonic. Okay, so I've added the leaflet, so I think that's a fix on this one. Pretty, pretty neat. Nice, good work. Thank. Oh yeah, Kid Cosmic. Such a cool style. I don't know if you guys missed her, but Raz Renee was in here earlier. She worked on Kid Cosmic. Animator on it. Yeah. Raz Renee also worked on Starlight Brigade, uh, yeah. Magnum Bullets, and Mystic Crystal with us. Yep, she worked on all three of those as a background artist, but she's also an incredible animator. She does both. She's got incredible drawing skills and really good animation skills. That's awesome, Peter Steves. Heck yeah, it's the same for me as well. Hearing people doing awesome stuff is like, oh, it makes me want to do awesome stuff. It's time for me to finally finish this background that I started. It's, fine. it's time for us to finally find out where the wire goes. Can you make it? Go and jump. Go and jump. You can do it. Go on. Yeah. Let me be, let me move this for you. There you are. Go on. Well, this is the one. A better. And the color of the layers, I'm changing red. Elon does smell. I mean, <laughs> I've never been in his vicinity, but I just know. Yeah, Craig McCracken's art is incredible. the type of people who would have an extension plug with like 17 other extension plugs plugged into it. I need to check in with you, Doig. Yeah. So you've finished the four that you were going to look at today. No, I need to do six again. Okay. So but you still need to put two hours on your timer and ping over onto that. Okay. No, I don't mean right now. I'm just saying I'm checking with you. Yes, I still need to do that, yeah. Okay.
think that looks good. So, what are your thoughts about the timeline for everything? Um, Is it going to be tomorrow morning? I think so, yeah. We need to um, ask our the person we're staying with in uh, Thought Bubble Town. Yes. Um, if they know what the address of the air EMB is, just in case we need to ship to there, because I don't currently know it. Are we shipping to that, or are we shipping to my dad, or are we shipping here? If we're... I think we need to ship either to my dad or to the Airbnb. It's probably safer to ship to your dad, but it does rely on him. When is he going? When is he coming over? I can check with him. Okay. So yeah, don't worry, Corrupt 3D, we've accounted for that. However, I do need to know what time you're planning on sending things off tomorrow, Mike. Like, um, what time do we need to, to get things ordered? I, th I think... Let me check. Let me check what they're saying on the thing now. Yeah. Because it changes daily. Uh, do this. Oh, my... My chrome is dead in the water. Yeah, Berry Paints, that's a great piece of advice. It's like when I was making Start Brigade. I wanted it to feel nostalgic. So rather than going back and watching stuff from that era and trying to like carbon copy it, I instead tried to evoke the feeling that they gave me. So I tried to make how the old stuff felt rather than remake what the old stuff was, if that makes sense. Thought just hit 100,000. Oh, incredible. Woo! Go Thor! Amazing. So you're saying congrats, I think. Yeah, yo! He got 60,000 followers in one day. Isn't that incredible? Or subscribers, I should say, since it's YouTube. Hey, Blueberry Bean! Hello! Did I even make Doggy's tea? I did. You did, yeah. I did do that. Uh, do you remember what you were doing? Yeah, looking at um, phone documents, battle stitched. <laughs> <laughs> It's time to steal his editor. Okay, it's being weird. It's like order within three days. Two hours, 25 days, 24 seconds to get a Thursday dispatch. Which I, I believe is dispatch is like they send it, so then we have to add delivery on top. But I think that's wrong. Interesting. Can you look at the website and see if it does the same sort of weirdness for you? Yeah. Whereabouts on the website am I looking? Let me link you to this. Because I can just go to the website. Yeah. Just go to products, then booklets, and then saddle stitch books. Okay. But dispatched on Thursday is pretty good. If we get like next day delivery, like it's going out of their doors on a Thursday. Sorry, it's been weird for me too. Weird. Maybe they're. Maybe a lot of people are using them stuff. Yeah, three days, two hours, 26 minutes, 24 seconds. And the time's going up instead of down. <laughs> the seconds are counting up. Okay. And they've spelt dispatch wrong. So I don't know. I don't know. 
I guess we'll just have to check in again in a few hours or something. It was like this yesterday, though. Well, <laughs> maybe we'll be selling digital PDFs. So yeah, I don't know. I mean, who, what's your plan though? To send it off before midday? Like what? Yeah, yeah, I think so. I just want to know what the solid... My, my plan is to finish colors tonight before I go to sleep. That's my plan. Currently. And then send it first thing or something. Yeah. Okay. Is that cool with you? Yeah. Are you planning to stream all of it? Or are you planning to... Uh, if you want to call it at some point, we can. Well, I mean, you're, ha you're welcome to stream by yourself as well. Yeah, that's fair. So I'm just I'm just basically checking what your plans are, Doig. My plan now is to keep working on the colors. I'm not really thinking beyond that. Are you going to keep streaming? I'm cool to keep streaming. Do you like to keep streaming? E yes, okay. I think so. If you're okay, what what's your plan? How are you feeling? Because you're kind of you feel like it feels like you think you I feel, feel like, like you're I'm done. At a little a bit of a loose end. You could assemble the cover. Put the layers on with the art that I did. Um, I was, yeah, I was just going to export for you just for layers that you're going to put over the top. But I can certainly do that. Yeah. It's not that I feel at a loose end. It's just that I have limited work that I can do right now. Yeah. So I'm just figuring out what I'm doing based on what you're doing. Yeah, I'm just, I'm just going to keep going. It's like I can only see a few steps ahead of me, you know? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah, I know. My question more was like, do you want to keep streaming what we're doing or do you want to... I wanna... think so. I think it's keeping me focused. Okay. But if you were like, I'm really tired, I think we should call it, then I would be like, oh, okay. That's why I was checking in with you. You yeah. were like... I appreciate that. How's everybody else feeling? Did we go to college for animation? You don't think it's really necessary? I agree that it's not really necessary. I did have a go to college for animation, which is one of the reasons I believe it's not really necessary. <laughs> it's because I may have gone to college for animation, but the amount I learned at college about animation was definitely stuff that I could have just learned not a college for animation. However, it was nice to get to meet other people who were interested in animation. That was a fun part of it. In a today's world where you're already connected to a bunch of your friends so and can easily join things like animation servers, it's no longer necessarily required to go to a building in order to meet people who like the thing you like. But it used to be. Yeah. So it, I think it more depends on how you learn and how you want to learn. I think having that peer group is really important. Yeah, and I think particularly in like America and Canada, there are some uh, universities and colleges with very good reputations. So maybe they're worth going to. You know, the ones where they have instructors who have actually done animation before and, you know. 
level of experience. Yeah, the social aspect of school is very good. Like college slash university is a cool place where you're no longer thrown in with people because you have to be. Now you're thrown in with people because you've all chosen to do the same thing. So you all automatically have shared interests, which makes it a lot more fun. Oh, I can show your screen again, right? Yeah. Sorry. Okay. Windows noise, yeah, sorry. <laughs> you chew Windows Lab Brigade, aw. Carnia, welcome, thank you for the raid. Whoa, Flickasaw. You chew worked on many classic films like Roger Rabbit, that's really cool. Who said that? Flickasaw. Welcome, Carnia. Who's your tutor? Gatorade. <laughs> hey. Welcome. That's very good. We are making a comic book. What were you up to? How are you allowed to name him? <laughs> His name is Mike. Okay. I don't know. My tutor also worked on it, so I was just curious. Ah. But his name was not Mike. Ah, gotcha.
Oh, you made a spooky November ween pick. Awesome. Ooh. A pick? That's awesome. Because spooky for a whole other month. I like the sound of that. You can't make her stop being spooky. There we are. I've just put a real big ugly extension cable back there with a bunch of plugs in it. Because Why? I feel like they would do that. Okay. Just have a bunch of extension plugs. I think that's all the corrections needed to this page. Unless I've missed something. color this for Doig and then he doesn't have to worry. How nice I am. What are you coloring? I'm coloring stuff I just drew in. Oh, yeah. Go for it. Oh, did you link in your picture? Did I miss it? Feel free to link in the art if you like, if you haven't already. I like now what dog's name is India. That's how it works. Yeah, so we're essentially crunching on a short 10 page comic that we're trying to get ready for tomorrow morning because we need to send it to the printers then for it to be ready for the weekend where we have a convention that we want to bring this to our table for. So it's just a little Sonic fan comic based around Shadow and Cream. It's a little story, but we've been working on it basically all week to try and get it ready in time. And today is our last day that we get to work on it. So it's exciting and a little bit scary at the same time. Doi here is colouring everything and I am drawing stuff. So I've basically finished drawing stuff now, but I'm going through and correcting all the drawing mistakes I've made. I've made so many. So many things I've forgotten. Yeah,
Okay. And I'll just put up here, Rouge Tail Correction. Mike Undertale. <laughs> you love the girl in the Glim comic, really? Wow, thank you. Wow, thank I didn't know that you even you knew that Glim existed. Thank you very much. Who said that? Carney Art. Oh cool. Thank you. Thank you. I'm really, really happy you enjoyed it. Well, we're doing a little Sonic the comic now. And, you know, fingers crossed. that there's not a hairline between the border. And then I'm gonna make sure that this is all labelled correctly. I'm cuddling this with uh, what if Swifty had a Sonic show? If I had a Sonic show? Yeah. Oh. Catering to my dreams. Yep. I need to make to this page? Don't think there really are any fixes I need to make to this page. This page is pretty nailing it pretty pretty well. Assuming these are all saying YK. They should be. Good. We had time to check, I know, but I just remembered. It's a good time to remember. Put it off anymore. Sorry, dog. Your fate is sealed. I think this is hitting the emotional thing in the top panels. I feel like there's something a little missing. Can you trim off some of that stuff which is overlapping the uh, panel at the top, just yeah. underneath it? And the ding dong needs to have a colour. just to make it stand out.
feel the same One, nine. I don't think he really needs a nine on his shirt there. He has it there where dogs fixed it. Aha! Here we go. I forgot to put Cream's uh, vest on. Golden Hour.
This is this is Shadow's fucking hero moment. This is how this is, this is how Cream sees him. I gotta make him look heroic. some additional stuff to you to make you feel real cool. What if I do this? Oh, yes. Now he read.
thanks for the follow. Appreciate it. Oh, yeah. Thank you very much. Sorry, I'm so, like, focused at the minute. Yeah, same. Sorry for the silence. What do you think of this sort of approach for Shadow in the last panel? That's nice. Like he's just kind of bait. Like I'm, I'm kind of seeing this as like this is hero looking back at the amazing hero that Shadow is. I'm trying to get that kind of golden light thing on him. I think it's a nice instinct. Yeah, I'm tr I would try and keep it from being too much. I might like yeah. go back here. Look at the art. Oh, okay. Oh, this art. This art just here. Oh, it's beautiful. Oh, what? Why if I just? No, come on, let me see it. <laughs> That's amazing. Carney Art, is that you? As in, is that your art? No, it's like a depiction of you, but is that, is that your art? Wait, there's slight booba. Yeah. Oh. oh. There is slight booba. That's okay, well, look though. at it from back here then. <laughs> now there's only small booba. The slightest of booba. That looks amazing. Gorgeous work. Lovely. Whoa! Hey, thank you so much for the subscription. We really appreciate it. Thank you. I'm going to come over here with you. I'll stand here out of your way. Let's see. I think I got everything on that page. Okay. Save it. I love color and swift yarn. <laughs> she made the line, she made them all cool. Let's see, is there anything I in this page that I need to worry about that I did wrong? Yes! Shadow's glove. She made them all cool. Yeah, yeah. It's like. That's swift. My process is just trying to remember what Mike has said over the past three days for every single page. Sorry, I should have written them down. It's okay. You know. Yeah. Love color and swift. You got a little burst of energy. She's awesome. I love your art. No. I still haven't gotten to page six. I'll do that soon. Yeah, you're gonna need to. Yeah. It's gonna take you till 11 at the minute. Oh my god. Yeah. You should give yourself two hours on the clock. okay if I make these not black shadows? Uh, yeah. Why don't you make them look better? Mm. Black thing. Into this, like this. 
can do anything on the wrong layer. Oh, neat. doing a draw draw right now. Go. Here we go now. Set the timer. Here we go now. Oh my god, two hours. Oh no. That's the wrong timer. Edit timer. Bring the hours down. Yo, start. Ten fixes. Do I have any fixes? I don't think I have any fixes for this page. I think this page is because I think it's the last page I did. It's pretty okay. There is like a weird hairline gap around the bottom that I could take care of. Weird. Yeah, there's just like a one pixel gap around the colouring at the bottom. I don't know what that's about. Maybe something got nudged? Yeah, maybe. Thank you so much for the subscription. Frosty Cones are 20 months. Wow, time really does sonic by. It goes so fast. You're right. That's why they say that the clock has been left. How are you doing, Frosty Cone? You really need to update and clean out old and fresh your emotes. They look great, though. They look awesome. the hairline at the edge. My curse has been able to spot one pixel gaps. Oh, 
high, little man. Hey, I think I'm gonna go and play with him. Cause I'm gonna, I'm gonna grab myself some food as well. Okay. I've done all the fixes now for every page that I have access to. Cool. Unless I've missed something, I've done every fix. Awesome. So you can tell me if I have missed something. All I think of it doesn't matter at this point. All of the um, layers that I've touched, I've marked in red. Okay. So if something's balked, you can easily find what I've done. Okay. Um, yeah. So, excuse me, I'm going to leave and be back in like 20 minutes or something. Okay? Okay. I'm going to go get some food. I'm going to play with him a little bit. Play with our cat is what she means. Yeah. We've got two cats and they're like, Marr. Dangtown says, when you guys hit 100k on YouTube, we'll have to make this coin with worms, lol. We'll have to ask Thor for some advice on how to hit 100. Yeah, Chaos Sphere is a great joke. 100% not mine, but great joke. Thanks, guys. I'll see you soon. See you, so Bye, everyone. Fill this up. Now it's dog time. You're right. They need a jersey. His tips for shorts was daily uploads and unchecking the notify subscriptions box. So you don't notify your subscribers and you just keep posting to not subscribers. Interesting. I mean, it seems to have worked for him. I think a big part of it might have been the, the reaction to, like it feels like Asmongold's watching his thing and reacting to it is the, but he has so many other things to go watch now. Thanks, love. The border is wet. The border is wet. Both inside and out. Oh, that's good stuff. Uh, you guys ever um, you guys ever heard of this water thing? Drinking water? It's good. I recommend it. Moist people have heard of water. That's very good. That's a very that's a very good joke. I like that. Thanks for using the chrome now.
What if I just did this? No. Yeah, Thor is Thor is doing a good It doesn't look like it's slowing down either, so That's awesome. I'm glad that us streaming so often has meant that you have like something to cozy up to. It's rad. I honestly don't mind streaming this much. Like my ideal is that we have personal projects and we just work in them and we stream the process. We share what we're working on we kind of demystify what it how it is that we work on stuff you get to see it in real time the process that we go through it inspires you you make cool stuff we are able to hopefully sustain ourselves on like you know twitch twitchy you know monetization stuff and we just aren't beholden to anyone um like I showed you earlier, the comic that we made during like the Frostbite thing. It's just like, what if we just started making our own stuff again? The dream, yeah. Yeah, we got a good vibe here, Corrupted. Or as Swifty calls you, Corrupt 3D.
Um, so, all right, like our mod Martina uh, had been editing a bunch of uh, shorts for us. They're on our VODs channel. Um, and we have a friend called Toddly Enough who was like kind of doing a review of our channel and saying that there was like a bit more we could be doing and um, a different approach to their editing style to them. So I do wonder like, what, <clears throat> what we could be doing uh, differently that would take what we do on stream and make an impact like that, but like, I think it's all about like getting something that energizes people. And Thor obviously has done that. You have to chop the hell out of shorts to get rid of as much dead air as possible. I think that's maybe a part of what we need to do with ours. Um, there is a bit too much time to them. I think we should filter them onto the main channel though, rather than trying to push the VOD channel. Thor is good about telling stories, yeah. But so should we be. <laughs> I wonder what would happen if Thor were to uh, stream to YouTube now. Or whether he's like, well, everyone came from YouTube over to Twitch, which is wild. I know he does. I wonder wh what impact this would have had now. Like the last time I saw Thor streaming on YouTube, he had like 19 people. Hey Kuma, go play with Swifty. Play Swifty. Why are you here? Swifty. Why are you here? What are you doing? He's just a little boy. A little boy. I fucking love my cat. I love my cats, but my one of them is next to me. I fucking love him. <laughs> Here's a big reason why I love him. This is what he's doing right now. Just fucking there. Hello. <laughs> Just he was sitting, looking up at me. He's bred, yeah. Our cats have one brain cell and this one has never had it. Just the googliest. The googliest. Bye-bye. 
like Swifty might have started pray playing, playing with them. Just full goober mode in here. Uh, he, yeah, he, he did. He just flumped over and sewed his whole ass. Aww. I'm surprised. Have you been playing with him? Not yet. Not yet, okay. That's why it's through here then. Yeah. Oh no. Welcome to Dog Swift. I'll try Juzilla. It's so smart as a shading. She figures things out and causes much trouble. <laughs> oh. Ours can be the same sometimes. What are you looking for? Hot water bottle. Probably next to the bed somewhere. It's not. I don't know then. It's not. What? What? Ah! So she just said, "Hands are so cold," and then put it on the back of my neck. What I like about Thor as well is that like he's got this success, this sudden success. And the first thing he said to me is like, dude, I want to raid everyone as much as possible. Like he's, he's, he's already thinking about how this can benefit other people. What a bro. So what are India doing? Isn't line art right? Um, India was making fixies before, but India drew this comic that I'm coloring. So you're watching me work at the moment. Uh, find a fix for you. That I can maybe do if you want. Mother bird needs a shark. anyway.
Give the bird number two. I think someone else has two. Uh, I've taken small breaks. Today's deadline. Swifty's currently taking a break. She's been she's been good with breaks. She had a shower and everything earlier. better. You're loving Cream's murder face. Did I just read that out before? <laughs> I'm, yeah, I'm withering a little bit. <laughs> yeah, you like little Swifty doing a derp. It's pretty good, yeah. Uh.
Try to change, but you want something else. Why cut off your wings? You could change the world, and I'd still be a mess. It's too late, too late, too late, too late. Slide down. Shadow would just end the game before it is even begun. Yeah, probably. But he's trying to learn how to play with others. I guess he's just learning how to play.
it's that old dog too. Well, there it's kind of like kids and parents. So it's uh, it's who Swifty is put in his uh, kid dogs. Parental hero. About 10 pages and the time was going to be tough but doable but then Swifty fucking did this <laughs> I was not anticipating the dodgeball pages to get so 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 intense. <laughs> it's a 10 page comic with the heart of a 20 page comic yeah probably could have told a like 20 page comic a little less
Hey, how do we get this to feel cool? Or is it already cool and I don't need to do anything? <laughs> this is fucking hell. Hard mix. Hard mix, yeah. Destroyed. You liked it when it was orange. Okay. Well, the backing was orange or the lines were orange? in my mo moment of need. Hey y'all, I'm back. I had some dinner. I played with the cats. I got another hot water bottle. I charged the iPad so that Doug could use it to look at cool Scrapneck Island in this boat. Oh God, this shit is so good. Right? Do you want to tell them about Scrapneck Island? Scrapneck Island is so good. And now I'm like looking back at my page and being like, fuck. Oh. You don't have to be like that. I mean, they just keep it simple. It's it, just all in color choices and stuff. It's not that simple. They've got a lot of texture work. Well, we've got a lot of texture work. What's it called? Scrap Nick Island. It's Scrap Nick Island. So, Scrap N I K. It's a story from IDW Sonic. And it's it's kind of like an offshoot of the main story, and it's really cool. It's got a really awesome team. 
uh, Jack Lawrence on art, Dan Barnes on writing, and Natalie Foudrain on the colours. And it's like really inspiring how cool it is. You're eating a Mexican lollipop. Oh, nice. You got that spicy candy. Yeah, exactly. That's nice. He says, if you want to do that much text work, good luck. You'll need two more days. Yeah. Like, we can just, uh, we can take some inspo from it. Yeah. But we're not going to be able to, to work miracles. We've already worked miracles. And work, miracle working is over. So let's see. I'm going to actually handle the back exterior cover. Okay. Um, so that mic doesn't have to. I'm just going to take inspiration from what Mike is doing. Do you want to... Uh... Do you want me to show your screen? Sure. So we've got this little doodle of them on the back cover. And I was uh, planning for Mike to do it, but Mike's got so much in his plate. And like, it's a pretty simple little illustration. I can easily just color it uh, using reference from Mike's colors. So I'll do that. sleeping what do you mean you're not sleeping i'm not sleeping this is i'm too pumped this you just put something so incredible in front of me i'm like it wasn't meant to stop you from sleeping doy i know but now i am
Scottish bears are known for having magical properties. Yeah. We shit rainbows. It's true. Can I test? Welcome to Doig Swift. Welcome to Doig Swift. This track was made by Paper Box House from Snap Cubes, or among other things from Snap Cubes, Sonic Dubs. It's Eggman. He started pissing on the moon to sing this for us. So good. Go doi, go doi, go doi, go doi, and get in swift day, get in swift day, get in swift day. Yeah, let's go. Ah, there's nothing like the smell of a deadline the next day. Get a whiff of that fresh, fresh deadline. It smells like creativity and panic. It's actually kind of serendipitous that you're on this page while I'm through because I can just use it for reference for these costumes. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Sorry. What is it? I'm just going hard. You're just having fun. If you're gonna do something, you may as well fuck it. Hell yeah. Hell yeah, man. You're gonna I, do it. I'm fucking just adding to it. your fucking chaos sphere over here. How often do you think Shadow has to touch up his red highlights? I was wondering that the other day. Like, does he have like a routine? They're natural, it's, come on. You don't think he like, gives himself little streaks? He looks cool. Someone should ask that on one of the uh, Sonic Ask Me Anythings on Twitter.
Is this too much? I think it's pretty funny. <laughs> okay. Let me show you my ultimate power. I'll show you my ultimate power. I'm not even tired. We're in your car. We can drive away. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. We're almost there. I'm loving this feeling of something new. Just write what I needed. Take me there. We can drive away. Oh, yeah, yeah. Bye bye. Bye bye. bye, bye, bye. To the midnight radio. We can drive through the night, sing along to the midnight radio. Don't wanna wait all my life. Can't remain, no delay, gotta let it go. A gentle breeze, the night's got a fever to the moon. <laughs> Would Pale Pot and Bull in the Shadow House Alice as a comb over? <laughs> maybe. Maybe, yeah. I feel like that'd be where his bald patch would go. You know? Right where the stripe is. Is Rev doing show and tell right now? I don't know. I don't know. Oh, what happened? Hello? <coughs> okay, my thing is just stalling. Should be okay. A save. Can I use my eraser, please. Show me the eraser tool, please. Maybe I should uh, close it and open it again. There, things seem to be working again now. Yo, Skull Pirate Mike, welcome in. Hello, Skull Pirate Mike. How's it going? Swifty passed me a uh, Scrapneck Island on the iPad and was like, here, for inspiration. And now I gotta go fucking hard. <laughs> it was it was meant to help. It does help. Good. But it shows me where I'm a bit holding back. I want you all to be aware I've been holding back 
Why? Time. Time. Don't. But this page is like the page to let go on. Yes. If this page is lame, it deflates the whole like dodgeball thing. I, dude, I watched fucking one of the episodes of, uh, all right, all right, Matt Braley. I see you. What? I fucking see you. There's so many references in Amphibia that just f sort of fly by. To what? Uh, there's a Naruto reference. Is there? Yeah. Where? There's a part where fucking, uh, is it Sasha? takes off some armor and sh they're in like heightened gravity and it's both like a fucking DBZ reference and a Naruto reference all at the same time. You know that um, that last bit was boarded by small butts. This is not in that episode but that's awesome. Yeah. I'm noticing that um, also one of the directors Jen Strickland she boarded Jen! the she boarded the um, blowing the payload Yes. Uh, video that we did and her stuff is fucking phenomenal and every time her like do 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 yeah that's how I first learned about the fucking the riddle Nick Kershaw's um every time one of our episode comes up I just smile I'm like yeah here, here so we go good. so good Is the Spider-Man reference the Mary Jane disappearing? One. I feel like that's what they would reference if they were going to reference anything. I assume you mean the animated show. You will know, you will know when you see it. Okay. In Amphibia. Yeah. I haven't got to uh, season three yet. So if it's in season three, we won't have seen it yet. I know he says I should watch Amphibia. Yeah, I think you'd like it. It's funny, dude. It's really funny. There's an Earthbound one too. There's also reference that looking over the shoulder meme, which I thought was a little bit funny. What when the couple's walking? This looks like he just fucking murdered some kids. <laughs> the, the spatter may be a bit much. I was gonna just do lighting. I see, I see, I see. But yeah, it looks like.
Can't get over the little turtle's face. <laughs> oh, the big turtle. <laughs> the one who's like sneaked up on Shadow. Being very <laughs> sneaky. <laughs> Got a lot of this. Peter Steve says, I wonder if with lighting it can cause a scene to change to be very dark and not for kids. I think absolutely, if your lighting is a blood spatter. <laughs> <laughs> this is alright, right? Yeah. Yeah. Shadow's cool shoes are simultaneously the most frustrating, difficult thing to draw and the coolest shit I've ever seen. I knew you were going to say that. Like, I want Shadow's shoes in real life so bad. They're so rad. They've got rockets in them. That's the coolest thing in the world. But my goodness, are they like not simple to draw? I don't think I've ever drawn them correctly. And that includes in this comic. There's just so many little things to them. in the morning I put my hat on I walk outside and I say hello I go to the store and buy a tangerine sit under a tree and eat my tangerine this is my life save me from it <laughs> I want to go by Vados Sorry. Every single day I put on my hat and eat a tangerine. All my friends say, there is more to life. What is your dream? Could I have two tangerines? <laughs> Would that even be possible? Are there even two in the world? Surely. I can only have one a day. <laughs> Thank you for the encouragement. I appreciate it. Oh. Oh. Did I just make this a yeah? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you know, despite the fact it's obviously an incredibly captivating story, I did indeed make it up. Don't worry, folks. The person singing that song one day discovered a supermarket. And in that supermarket, they found all the tangerines they could fit in their pockets. And that's just what they did. They put all the tangerines into their pockets and walked out of the store, only to be arrested five minutes later for not paying. <laughs> Every day. I'm learning something new, like you have to pay for a tangerine. I don't know I what know. I was doing before. I only took 22. <laughs> In the tangerine <laughs> store. Ridiculous says, I love when my touchpad on the laptop decides to die for no reason. So cool. Paper it's box paper box house. house. I will eat. 3,000 tangerines! <laughs> That's a good way to die. I want to die eating 3,000 tangerines. 
Hello, paper box house. We're making a comic. We're making it as fast as our tiny hands can do it. We've been working on it for five days. And we got 10 pages. Doig is colouring it. I am currently working on the exterior design. And we're going to print it and take it to a convention at the weekend. Tell your friends. <laughs> or don't. Keep it a secret. Have all the power to yourself. That tangerine tune is the highlight of my day. What about the rest of the stream? <laughs> <laughs> Was that the best part? <laughs> How are you, paper box house? We just heard your Doug and Swift song that came on like 10 minutes ago. It still warms my heart. The Doig Swift song, yeah! It's so good. It's still on our playlist. I'll never take it off our playlist, ever. You couldn't pay me to do it. When did you start working on it? I think it's seven days of work now. We started working on it Wednesday afternoon. And it's now Tuesday evening. So it's almost seven days. This is a panel of Shadow playing dodgeball with some kids and I have added a little something something to the to it. Doig wants Shadow to murder the children. <laughs> but that's what's happening. Box House says, I'm alright, just got through singing a birthday song to a Mario Party song because my birthday is on Friday! What? That's awesome! Dude, happy almost birthday! Are you doing anything for it? Or are you just gonna chill and not do anything? Which sometimes is the best. When the rest of your life is doing a lot of stuff, sometimes sitting and doing nothing is the best. The best gift you could ask for. Or a tangerine. You have a stream! Oh, I'm sad I'm gonna have to miss it. It would've been really nice to catch it and be able to say happy birthday to you. But Friday is the day that we're traveling to Thought Bubble, which is the festival we're doing this for. So we're gonna be on the road, but I might do you a little doodle for your birthday. Say happy birthday. Another year on the planet. You made it. What am I doing? Ah, yes, the the thing he's wearing. We will have fun at the festival, thanks. We'll do our best anyway. We'll uh, we'll try, we might hide if it gets to be something that's a lot. Run away from our table. Yeah, birthdays are worth celebrating. See if I can surprise you. That's cool though, you're gonna upload the song on your birthday. Oh, have you played Mario Wonder yet? Speaking of Mario. 
I watched some people play it yesterday. It looked unhinged in a really good way. It's so good! <laughs> Amazing! <laughs> did you play it solo or did you get a scrungly party together? I know that's hard to do because it's like, doesn't it only work local? You played with some friends, that's awesome. Best way to play it. A friend is coming back with us after Thought Bubble. So I'm thinking that it, that would be a good time to grab it because then Doig and I can play with them and it should be real stupid. Oh, sorry, ridiculous. I hope that your computer troubles stop. Pal, you were thinking the same thing. It's Pal. Pal's coming to stay. <laughs> Since Pal's in chat, I might as well just say. Yeah, I was thinking Mario Wonder might be a real fun time. A cat says, Rah! which means I've done sleeping. Come and play with me again until I fall asleep again. Where were you when I woke up? Where, oh, where were you when I was on the loo? Your man. Now he's going to play with something on the floor very sadly to make me feel bad. <laughs> no, I'm not coming to play with you. It doesn't matter how cute you are. I already did. You have to let me do a little something now. I'll play with you again later. Once I finish my deadline. No. No in the door. The sad part about clipping is sometimes the clip ain't long enough. Oh no! Did you try and clip my tangerine song? It's too powerful to be clipped. It's unclippable. Yeah, yeah. There's a lot of red in these characters' designs. I didn't know it's because I haven't been the one colouring them. But yep. Cream and Shadow both have like a lot of red. Yep. Like peas in a pood. Yee. Let's go. To the front, to the back, to the down, to the up, to the round and the round. Playing sports in the round. Put the ball on the ground. My Photoshop is frozen again. I hate when he does this. I have to just close and reopen. It's the only way to save it. Bow wow. 
Wow. Wow, wow. Cool part of Mike says, I think there's only like three Sonic characters that don't have any red on their designs. It seems to be Yuji or a Kawa thing. Oh, really? The more you know. Let's see, let me guess them. Like, Rouge doesn't have any red. Does Knuckles have any red? Um, I feel like Blaze the Hawk. Blaze the Hawk? What am I talking about? Jet the Hawk doesn't have any red. Silver doesn't have any red. Big the cat. Big the cat doesn't have any red. I'm running out of characters. Next the weasel. I mean Fang the Sniper. I mean Fang the Hunter. Doesn't have any red. That's all I can think of. I give up. Yeah, Rouge does not have any red on her design, despite her name literally meaning red. Yes, this is this is a fact. A strange fact. Rouge! Rouge those knees. The gentleman loved the blushing knees. you think of that? <laughs> I love it. It's like it they've been hit with tiny nuclear blasts. Cool. Yeah, it's an interesting design decision for sure. Maybe they thought Rouge meant like pinkish or something. The ghosts, they come out of the house, they run around, they go back inside, the ghosts are gone. What a spooky story. Okay, so her little necktie is like a blue. Blue! What, what, what? So lonely. I'm feeling so lonely, yeah. Oh, ding dang, I've got her stripes. Okay, I fix. Fix the baby. Fix the baby. That was worthy, kids, right? Yeah, I think so. I forget, it was so long ago. Still had the iconic style even back then. Mm hmm. God, that animation's so funny. Wow, 
wow, wow, wow, wow. There we go. I might need to close the shadow a little bit. I'm sure that Mike would tell me that I've made his muzzle too yellow. In comparison to mine, yeah. Wow, wow, wow. Oh god, these dodgeball impacts are glowing. Yeah. There we go, so that's the back done. I don't know if it's a little bit too much now. Why does it sound like Matchbox 20? Shadow does not know the meaning of holding back. Yeah, that's what I love about what Mike's doing here. Playtime is over. Okay, so that's coloured. What else do I need to do? I can scale oh. it back a little bit if it's too much. Front cover. Like, it might be funnier if it's just pop, pop, pop. That's not what I wanted. Front cover exterior. Front cover exterior. Cool. I'm just going to get all of the design elements here. Duplicate these right way over here. He's just yelling. My cat is just yelling in the other room. Like, what is it? What's wrong? What? Why he yell? When did Cream learn to fly? It's forever, right? It's forever. Yeah, I think that's one of Cream's special powers. Is that she can fly using her ears. <laughs> yeah, Kuma's screaming. He might be lonely. I'll go and give him a bit more play. 
just played it in like 20 minutes ago. It's okay though. Let me pop all this in its own group. So everything else should be just as Mike left it. Oh, rad. Yeah, you like that? What do you mean just as I left it? What did you have to do? Uh, basically just bring the title in. Okay, cool. Because that's what wasn't working, right? Does it look the same to you? Yeah, I think so. I might just do it again just to sanity check. In fact... It looks, looks the same. It looks good, so I'm not, I'm not too fast. Close this, not save it. I'm just so paranoid in case I like do something that ju adjusts anything. Okay, that's it. It looks the same to me. Now I'll duplicate that through again. Yeah. Then I'll make that red so it's really easy to see where I've been. I'm just gonna adjust this a little bit. Okay, little man. All right. Shut up. I'm coming. Save that. Okay, I'll be, I'll be. Did you guys hear the meat? Yeah. That's helped clarify up the fan thing a bit.
Maybe I need to make... So much going on. <clears throat> hey, hello, Eric. How you doing? Hey, Onsta again. Hello. Calmed it down a little.
Okay, I'm back. Akuma has now become scared of the duvet. I'm sad to see. Scared of the duvet? Yeah, I was playing with him. And I I pulled the string across the duvet. Right. And he was jumping around on the duvet. And then he suddenly, like, started as though he'd stood on something he didn't like. And jumped okay. up, like, two feet in the air. Okay. And then did that tentative thing they do where they get really low to the ground and sneak up on something really trepidatiously and then bat it a little bit with their paw. Okay. And now he refuses to go on the bed. Oh. To catch the thing anymore. Oh no. So yeah. Uh, <laughs> what did he step on? I don't know. Just it was nothing under there. It was just duvet. I don't know. Yeah, I don't know what he got scared of. But this looks pretty good. What? The cover. It does look pretty awesome, huh? Yeah. I still, Classroom Chaos just, I doesn't. I'm sorry, dog. But that's many... what everyone voted for. I know. And I, th I think Lessons Learned is just as like, I don't think Lessons Learned is necessarily any better. Oh man, did you read that that comic about Shadow? Lessons learned? I feel like he learned a lesson. I don't know. Did you he doesn't really though. Did you read that comic about Shadow? Classroom Chaos? Well when you say it sounds better than when I say it. Guh. -huh. Got me some clone stampage. Ow, 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 ow. See, sample all layers. That should be fine. What's the problem? Onsta says, I like Classroom Chaos, but you can sing Live and Learn to Lessons Learned. Lessons Learned! Don't. Living oh, on no. the edge of tomorrow. Oh no, that's really good. Lessons Learned, all the words for yesterday. Lessons Learned! Don't. Don't make me love it. Thanks, Onsta. Onsta! thing is, I just don't want it to sound preachy, and it's like, so that Shadow doesn't really learn anything. He does. No, he doesn't. He does. He doesn't. He to love himself. <laughs> you don't put macaroni art on a door without learning something. I don't know. It is the ultimate art form. You can call it that. Yeah, I still never found a place to put that joke. So sad about it. He <laughs> learns to read. Shadow learns to read. Also, hello, Onster. Also, have you seen this yet? Joyce decided not to sleep. She passed me nightly before Drain's work and was like, this might help you, and then left me.
<laughs> fuck around, hanging on the edge of tomorrow, fighting, fighting out. out. <laughs> That's pretty good. Beep 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 beep. Boop 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 boop. Beep 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 boop boop boop. Beep beep boop boop boop. Beep. Pop pop. Pop a doop pop a doop a doop pop a. So yeah, let's see. I have done the corrections I can do on the pages that you've given me. I've done the back. I've put together the cover. So I don't know if you might still want to make changes to that, I've got no clue. Make changes to what? The cover? No, I think we can probably pop the cover down. Okay. You're doing something to his eyes. Go on, go for it. Still smirking at the panel of Shadow going Chaos Sphere and beating the two kids in the face right after. <laughs> that's good. Good, I'm glad that's making you smile. I'm saving that. I've made a few tweaks to it. It's like that scene in Cloud of the Chaps of Meatballs where he's decking the kids in the face with ice cream snowballs. It's exactly like that. I don't know how we can top this. Maybe with hot fudge. <laughs> I love that scene so much. It's so fun. Okay, I'm closing that. Don't need that anymore. Nope. Closing the line up. Style. 
It's like style. Oh no, wait, I don't want that. Hmm. So now I am working on a standee that I'm hoping I'm going to be able to get printed. Oh we'll yeah. See. Where are you getting that from? Digital printing. Oh, they do those as well? I don't know if they do, that's the problem. Oh. Do they do them? I don't know. I, don't, I haven't looked. So we're going to have to find out. We're going to be so prepared for next year's thought bubble. Yeah. That looks so good, dude. Thanks. Everybody buy the book. It's really good. Look at this. Stop that. Look at this fucking- Look at it, though! Holy shit, dude. What a great sense of design. Why are you- Why are you making that white? Does that make it more standy? Well, because it's not- You're not going to be able to cut out all these little bits. Okay. If I print it as a standy, are you? So I have to, like, create an outline that's going to be easier for them to laser cut. Let's hope they do standees. <laughs> they might not. The image canvas size. Percent. Let's increase it by like 110. All over. It's just the thing you put on a table. Like, is it plastic or something? Oh, cardboard. Cardboard standee. Gotcha. We just had a printer and some card. Yeah, but we don't, so this is, this is what we do instead. But I noticed that Baby Swift's dad is colored black in the top panel. All right, yeah, yeah, that's a mistake. Also, it does, it's, is it your mom or your dad? I don't know. I got mom energy from it. I don't know, I was thinking like sister. Sister, Yeah. That makes sense. It does, especially because I don't have one. <laughs> it does not make sense actually, yeah. Oh no, oh no. I'm not done. Sorry, everybody. Time to shit yourselves. <laughs> I'm nearly done, but I'm not quite done. Are you? What? That's awesome. Yo, that panel where they all get hit is looking so good. This one? Yeah. What do you think? Well, I hope so. I hope you. I'm glad you like it. Shadow's going fucking hard. Yo. Chaos sphere. It looks great. Um, I've taken your line out of the trees in the top in this panel. I can't cannot get it to work. So I'm just going with like implied tree shapes, really faded, so that everything else can read on top. Okay. Cool. 
you don't really have a scope to be like, no. I, yeah, I mean, I you guess. can take out the trees entirely if you want and just have a floor plane and an abstract background, you know? It's kind of become that, really. Just abstract tree. Yeah, if it's easier to take trees out entirely, you're perfectly able to. Sweet. I believe this is so now I rasterize layer style. Stick on, observe transparency, to make sure everything is as it's meant to be. Take that off. Oh wait, we balked. What is this down here? Stop feeling pain. You stopped feeling pain? <laughs> Just wanted to say it. What has that been? Blue Sky Wolf, thanks for the raid. So many oh, raids yeah, thank today, you thank much. you. How's it, how are you, how are you doing? How was your stream? Trimming. Oh wait, I need to take, Never mind. There we go. Now I can trim. Oh, it actually trimmed correctly for me. Okay, awesome. Save that. Now let me check out. I'm gonna go to Digital Printing's website check out if they actually do standees <laughs> i'll also check the booklet time again and see if it's fixed itself okay oh no it's still it's still it's still barky i think their website is just a little bark barked. don't you think that that's like so typical though oh for us that it, it was gonna their website would work every single day up until the day of our deadline yep. at which point it then breaks and refuses to tell us how long we have to send it in. Yeah, no, that, that, that seems like us, yeah. It's like, it's so, it's just, it's like it was custom made for us. Yeah. <laughs> What's a struck card? That's kind of what I want. Making some game sprites, that's amazing. I'm sorry for a less attentive to chat than we usually are. Oh yeah, are. I'm sorry. We are uh, heavy crunch. Stream time is also live. We were, we were like fucking 12 hours in or something and I tried try to check numbers. We, we got raided by Thor, who is exploding right now. And uh, I wanted to see the impact of his raid, but uh, the stream ended. So we've been going like 14 hours now.
Eight hours before the stream died. Are we on hour six or something now? Thor was explosion over you. He's such a good guy. He's such like a uh, like stand-up guy. I'm really happy for him. Yeah, he, if there's anyone who deserves it, it's Thor. For real. I hope he enjoys all the fresh memes he's gonna get. I'm sure he will. Like, he's been trying to make this happen for so long that I'm sure now it is happening, he's gonna be able to take advantage of it. Like, he's a smart dude. He's so smart. We were live before you woke up this morning, have since gone to work and come home and you're still going. Well, we have been at work all day. We sure have. If, if I could have anything, it would be the ability to work on personal work, stream the process, and not worry about money. That would be... That'd be cool. Hey, if a personal work is making a comic, we can take the conventions. That's all good. Namely, I, I am having so much fun on this, dude. Oh, as, good. as tight as the deadline is, I haven't really felt this alive in a while. <laughs> I haven't felt this alive. That's true. Aww. I'm making comics with one of the best storytellers like going oh, right now. No, on. that's not. No, no come on now. No, uh, shut up. <laughs> okay, so I have some bad news, which is that they don't print standees. At all? No. It's weird. The closest that I can find is something called a struck card, which is just square. So we <laughs> could have this. If you got like a palette knife, you could. I don't know if I trust myself to do that. But we could just get a white background on this. Yeah. Like, you know, we could just... Boop, and have that. Yeah, I mean, that's still fun. If you want. It's still fun. Like, we could get the... They're basically... I would make a great sticker as well. They look like... Careful. It, it doesn't yeah, reveal we're not anything. Locking. Okay. Okay. If that's what they do, that's what they do. Well, what do you think? This is what's happening here with the. This is when you have to order. It's just like, it's. I don't know what it's doing. It's counting up, is what it's doing. Yeah, it's counting up 49 seconds, 50 seconds, 51 seconds. So yeah, I don't know. Do you do you want one of these or would you prefer not to have one of these? I think get it. It just stand behind our books, essentially. Yeah, better to have to not. All right. In that case, what size do we want? Because they have a six, a five, a four, and a three. And this is not a three. You don't think? <laughs> no, a a four was what I was thinking. A four sounds good. So this is 16 inches by 16 inches. Yeah, we could box cutter it if it works. It's what? 16 inches by 16 inches. Yeah, sounds good. Yeah? Yeah. You know how big 16 inches is? <laughs> no. Okay, so you don't actually know. 40 penises. <laughs> 40 penises. Oh, so no. That's a big 16 inches or very small penises, <laughs> depending. 42 centimeters. So it's big. Okay. What? 40 centimeters? 42 centimeters. That's 
A3, I think. At 300 DPI. So that's just... Oh, you mean the artwork itself is that? that that's, yeah, that's how much, that's how big the canvas is. Let's pop that down there. In fact, here's a better idea. Mm -hmm. um, if you end the Amy for a sec. Okay, you're NDA. I'm just going to make an A4 canvas and then drag this onto it. Okay, you can un NDA me. So I smart objected it and okay. dragged it onto an A4 canvas. Cool. And now I'm going to bring this to the edge. And we are going to just fill, fill this black. And that'll be the space where the books can sit. Cool. Epic. Okay, so select this option. We want it portrait. And then we can choose our own specification. Paper type, silk. Recommended paper weight, 250 GSM. One side map. Andy Darkar, welcome. Hope you like comics, because we got things <laughs> to tell you. We just spent the last six days trying to make a 10 page comic, uh, fully colored, just all, all shebang. This is one of the pages. Um, it's about Shadow going to school for a, like, bring your hero to school day. Uh, how was your stream? 
Swifty is also making a cool standy. We're going to a convention at the end of this week and we're hoping to get stuff printed because we're mad people. <gasps> we're going to be so ready for whatever convention we go to after this one because we'll have all this stuff. Mm -hmm. If this stuff doesn't come, I might just sit at my table with nothing and just look like put a sign up just being like that's what you were gonna do don't talk to me Miang. <laughs> that's what you were gonna do before i was like we should make something yeah yeah it was i was just gonna i was just gonna fucking vibe i'll sign something bring your cast you, you don't know me i have no i'm no standing with you people What is a DST server we were all playing in? Let me guess. Dark Souls Terrarium. We've got a Glim Plush. You ever see our Glim Plush? We got it from a friend. It's on the store. No, it's not on the store, but it's part of store pictures. At dogswift.com. Okay, I got some bad news for you. Um, it'd be like 16 to get one of these. 16 to get one? Yeah. That's not bad. I don't think that's bad. It's pretty bad. Like, it's really bad. How much is it to get two? 18. How much is it to get 10 of them? 40 something. How much is it to get three? 20. Get three. <sighs> okay. I guess it, it'd be helpful to have a spare in case one gets scuffed or something. <laughs> 16 for one, 20 for three, 40 for 10. <clears throat> it's the problem with these uh, websites where you're meant to print stuff and order it. It's just... It's r always really hard to get one of anything. Oh, that doesn't even include the shipping. But I think we're gonna no, get like No, but we're gonna a, be shipping everything together, so. Hopefully, yeah. Yeah, look at this little guy. This little glim. <laughs> Abba -abba. Oh. Yarp. Ah. Yeah, this was made as part of a let's um, let's play, part of a cosplay um, from one of our friends. Can you please uh, NDA me? I'm gonna yeah. save this as a pedif. So I need a three millimeter bleed, which I'm going to remember this time. Canvas size, millimeters.
CMYK colour profile. Okay, cool, that looks the same. I'm happy. Save as Quim Strut PDF. Oh my trick. What's your trick? Color variation. Alright, uploading the artwork now. So here's another question for you, Doug. Uh, business cards. Yeah. Do you want any? No, I think the leaflets serve that. Or we could give people uh, bookmarks. Yeah, so let's do bookmarks. We've got a bunch of bookmarks that we can take with us and give people. Yeah, that has our link on it, doesn't it? Yeah, it sure do. Yeah, that's fine then. So you didn't do a back to your leaflets? No, I didn't. Do you want to do it for me? <laughs> Not really, but I guess um, I guess I, I could. I would have done it if I weren't colouring your comic, so can we... <laughs> you didn't have to colour my comic, sir. I know. You hoped I would. And you would make it cute and adorable. Mm -hmm. Please save me. I was hoping I'll you would offer. You. I was hoping you would offer. I just want so a little much. bit of. I just want a little bit of appreciation. That's I love all. you so much. Please make the leaflet. I'm so hopeless at that shit. Why would? I knew. I knew you were testing me, and I knew I would fail. And <laughs> I knew you were testing me, and I knew I would <laughs> fail. God, you're so helpless. <laughs> You were like, we can have leaflets if you make it. And I knew in the back of my head, she's like, she knows that I'm not going to do it. And she'll use this. Here's a problem. In negotiations later. You don't have a QR code. I don't have a QR code. I didn't look that up. And I don't know how to make one. So do you want to just take it off? And not no, have the one? The QR code is the whole point. Is it? Okay, well, in that case, we'll need to get one. Yeah. Does anyone... You're all savvy people in chat. How do we get a permanent QR code that's not going to expire? Like, don't just be like QR code maker online. Sorry, Carney Art, but like. We heard some of them expire. I, get, I made one for my mom and uh, pretty sure expired. hers expired. <laughs> Shh, don't tell her. Don't tell his mom. Don't tell my mom. No one tell her.
Not all of them expire. Your hasn't from... The QR code doesn't expire. It's a digital representation representation of text, like a URL. I don't know. Several people have told us that they expire and that they got them and then they expired after they got them. Like, we literally had two people in chat yesterday saying, I can't believe I got my business cards printed, put QR codes on them, then the QR codes expired the day after the con I was taking them to. Yeah. I feel like you have to buy one for it to not. Someone said you can get a permanent one if you don't go the corporate route. Like I just got it. I just searched online and got one ages ago. And I don't know where work? they. I don't know where they got them from. And does it still work, Mike? The one you got? Uh, I don't know. Okay. And that's not usually helpful, Mike. You use a browser extension to just make one. From what I'm reading, these QR code generators give you a pseudo link. They turn off unless you pay. That's probably what it was. So a QR, co QR code is parsed literally into text. So long as the encoded text. Would you guys want to help us make a permanent one that will never die? Please help us Highlander our QR code. We would be forever grateful. It is a scam. We just need it to point to either Linktree, Dogswift, or Dogswift.com. Add-ons a lot of in Firefox URL to QR code. And that works. So did you do this A5? Mike? Oh, sorry, what? Did you do this A5? E yeah, I think so. Let me add on three millimeters. To the You're still NDA'd by the way. Okay, you can un-NDA me now if you want. Adding on three millimeters blue. Oh, you made the twitchy purple. Oh, you're, I love you. So when I'm adding three millimeters bleed, I'm actually adding six millimeters because it's three millimeters per side. So that'd be 20. And that would be 27. No, that's, that's in centimeters right now. Oops. Let me just cancel that and go into it again so I don't bulk it up. Okay, so 148 millimeters. So that plus six is 154. 109 will become 215. Okay. Three millimeters is a lot more than you think it is, isn't it? Yes, it is. It is, yeah, sorry. It's okay. Front, and then we're gonna make it back.
<laughs> Look at that. I learned that from Natalie for Green. What did you do? Just like, you, you just color as if light's hitting it. It's good. I love that. You just color as if light's hitting it. Yeah. That does sound like an advanced technique. QR code to Linktree. Where? Okay. Someone helped us out. Iron Oki is offering one. Iron Oki. <laughs> Everybody, go check and test one of the thing. I'm tested too. Thanks, Pablo. the angle of it making it weird. Hang on. Oh, there we go. Bad. Does that work? It does. Like. You guys help us. Thank you so much. Ah, thank you. Um, is that, so you, can you assure me that that's not going to... Yeah, can you assure me that's not going to expire and stuff? I have to put Dropbox on in order to get any of these files. I feel unsafe putting it on though. I've got such a lot of work on there and it'll tank the stream. Putting what on? Um, Dropbox. Yeah, it will tank. What do you need from there? Um, I need the cute little uh, picture that David did the pattern you can look at you can look at it through the browser if you needed to the browser yeah go to dropbox.com and I'm not sure it. where it is so I was looking for the files right gotcha so it's gonna be difficult to navigate that I'm also looking for where I put the tutorial PDF do you remember I remember the PDF yeah I feel like that was probably on Sing Tracer now. Let me NDA you. Oh, is he blushing? He needs blushies. You can make those uh, red if you want. Blushy. Oh, 
Okay, we'll use this one then. Thank you. Thank you so much, Ironoki. Ironoki, thank you. Thank you so, 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 so much. You're the best, dude. Do you guys think it would be better to do the link tree or straight to our website? I think the link tree, maybe. I think our website is actually harder to navigate than the link tree. So. Hey, Rebecca Oni, we've been streaming the whole day. Like, the whole day. We're making stuff, though. Iron Oki, if you could, that would be amazing. Then we can choose. No, we haven't slept. We woke up uh, 14 hours ago. It's just been a whole day. It's like 11.43. Fuck, it's Sleep to the top of all. Place where they are and get them through the browser you said. So let me try that. Oh yeah, not 40 hours. No, 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 14, 14. Okay, you can put me back on screen now if you want. <laughs> that is, it should just be that on the back, that's all it is. <laughs> yeah, I love that. I love that image so much. David Liu. Genius. Photoshop. You're no clip, are you?
Dum, I know, Kisa, I, linked, I linked the QR codes in the VPO Discord and tagged Doig. I know, Ki, you're such a treasure. Thank you. That's uh, really kind of you. You've not only saved us money, but you've really taken that off our plates. Thank you. I appreciate it so much. What's a VPO? Uh, it stands for Virtual Interactive Puppet Overlay, and it's basically what Doig's built here. In fact, hold on. Here you go. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, I fucking love that drawing. it to say goodbye to everyone at the bottom of the report. Oh, cool. Actually you're gonna say see you there. Dog swifting, yeah, that's, yeah. You know what, I'm gonna write the text first and then draw the bubble around it. Maybe that's a smart way to do it, who knows? So fucking cute. Are you happy with it? Mostly, yeah. Mostly? Yeah, the top panel, I feel like it could be a little bit better, but I'm cutting the losses a little bit. I see. Is it okay for me to have feedback on it? Yeah, of course, this is your comment. Zoom, zoom, please. Let's take the whole screen. So I love everything from middle of the page down, mm -hmm. but the top half of the page, yeah. I think, is a little muddy and hard to see what's happening. I think it's a combination of the fact that you have like quite light lines with quite dark colors and then the grass feels quite muddy as yeah. well like if you look at the bottom yeah the panels you've done the grass there really stands out from shadow yeah that's the kind of feel i want for the stuff up there okay do you think it be possible to bring the grass lighter the lines darker so it's easier to separate people from each other people from the background because Everything at the minute is a mid-tone, it feels. Okay. Yeah, I can try. Thanks. Is the top panel okay? Similar feel. Uh, I think that, again, 
you could darken the line art and some of the characters on the right there. Okay. Because they're feeling a little like they're shrinking into the background. Yeah. And you could lighten the grass. I, I think I've rolled as a contrast in the bottom and a clarity that is missing from the top. And I take partial responsibility because I think the drawings are also clearer. So I think they're more helpful. Like you're fighting against messy compositions. Yeah, if I had more time, I think. But looking at you, you do have more time, so. I do that on the wrong layer. I sure did. Smart. Janae says, Doig, I'm about to ask the most important question, but are you feeling it now, Mr. Krabs? I mean, Doig, the sleep is calling and they want a refund back. You think you have a lack of sleep? I'm doing okay. What? I am feeling it now. But You're feeling tired. But I'm okay. I, uh, let me see if I can Google us <laughs> and find some screenshots from the streams. Doig and Swift. Feels a bit better. Does, it, does this feel a bit better to you? Oh, yeah, it already feels a little bit better. I think there's still a feeling of you faded out the background character, so there's this weird feeling of like mist over it. That's intentional. Right. It just makes it kind of feel less active. Like, I feel like if anything, the focus should be on the characters getting hit, not the characters throwing. So I almost feel like because they're in the foreground, they should be darker. 
And then the focus, yeah, and then the focus should be on the characters who are getting hit by the balls, rather than fading out the characters that are getting the balls thrown at them, and then brightening up all the other characters. that ever existed. Yeah, cuz like we got it, she got shit done. Swifty over here fucking saving her asses. <laughs> hey. We don't normally work this way. This is only because we left this. Oh, we don't, do we? This is unusual, is it? It's starting to feel like it's just our regular way to work. Yeah, I guess so. A little bit. This feel better? I got a sort of luminosity thing on here. On where? Yeah, on the on this panel. Uh, kind of picking them out. Picking the characters out. I actually like it better. without it on. I still. I think it's a matter of you choosing what the focus is, Mike. Okay. Do you wanna do you wanna send it over to me and I'll do a quick rough for you?
Uh, do you want it without it on? With, with, with what? Without that. Would you want it without this on? Yeah. I mean, it's in the folder if you want to grab it. I do, I just don't want you to be working on it while I'm doing it. I want to make sure that I'm not destroying everything you've worked on. So how do you want me to send it to you? However is easiest. Easiest is probably for you to grab it once it comes over. Okay, I'll grab it once it comes over. And I'll do five in the meantime. Okay. Oh, it's past midnight now. Derp snazzy, enjoy Yakuza! How are you, how are you doing, Onster? Are you feeling better, by the way, Onster? I feel like I only asked you this morning, but just in case I only asked you yesterday. You're at that. I thought you were getting a cat for a second there. Ah, I was getting some water because I'm parched. Alive just in time for Gaiden. Gaiden? Okay, let's see. Comic pages. And then I'm looking colour and page six, right? Yeah. Okay. Wait. That's what? old. Is it? Yeah. Okay, well, let me just close it. Why is that not sent to you? Is your sync sketch having problems again? Oh, new Nikuzi, thank you. I keep forgetting. I keep forgetting. Yeah, it's having trouble again. Well, maybe. I mean, you could do it from where it is there, but it's different. I mean, The only way around this is to close Photoshop all the files. Has it fucking used... It shouldn't be using my C. Maybe it's using temp, I don't know. Weird. Guys, my brain is so dead. What do you think we should put on the back of this leaflet? This is on the back of the leaflet of Pat's art. Worm Sonic says on still. No. I second Sonic Worm. No. I mean, that's what the people want. No. And then what information? You know, to tell people who we are and what they can like, where they can find us. 
Wow, that just sent 300 megabytes in very short amount of time. Meet your new god. Okay, you should have all of me. I just have it now. every time I try to write something. I'd like to inform everyone that we are at exactly 14,000 followers. We're at what? 14,000 what? Followers on Twitch. Oh, okay. Thank you. step one meal follow is that is that going to be one million or just one what's a what's a meal one meal dollar yeah we're we're at this follower count so suddenly uh because of thor's raid is it because of Thor's raid? Yeah. Oh my gosh, Thor, you're amazing. Thank you. We got like 150 people just followed us. Wild. Because of the raid, yeah. Must have talked a big game about us. Oh gosh. Okay, let's see. Oh, is it billion for UK? I, I would love a billion followers. Actually, you know what? I wouldn't. <laughs> That'd be really scary. That'd be scary as hell. Nearly there, Puffling. We've got the whole comic lettered. Just having some issues getting readability on this page. Hey no, Kuma, I'm really no sorry little boy, now. but it's a bad time for you to come in and, and need attention. Need somewhere to go. Need somewhere to go. He sounds very sad, yeah.
Are you just, oh my gosh, you're covered in cats. So many. Right, he won't go on the duvet. Yeah, he won't go on the duvet, right? He's terrified of it now for some reason. No clue why. Fair enough. That is clearer. Oh, uh, no, I'm sorry. I wasn't saying at you. I'm just trying to do something and it's being a bit of an ass. What are you trying to do? There we go. Cats are real bored with us. Here, you guys may as well enjoy this while I do this with them. My heart sing, ba 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 ba. You make everything, ba 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 ba. It's looking ba, a lot ba, better, groovy. dude. Try to find where the colors are for those guys. Yeah, sorry, it's, it's a lot of layers and a lot of like snap decisions and. Yeah, I just can't click on them. What's that trying to click on? Okay, so let me just lock that and I'll try again. I'll just go through like that until I find them. She's fucking dead. Dead little one. Came through because he's gonna play, but you sleep.
Fish, yeah, fishing for cats. Yeah. She's so sleepy. We're all sleepy, little one. All right. Done. Done. Tired yet? Nope. Follower emotes just made universal. Whoa. Cool. Follow emotes? Yeah, emotes you get for following a channel. Is it made universal? As in you can use them on other channels? That means you guys can use our jelly cats elsewhere. Look at them. They cute. They cute. Oh, Universal's and I think every affiliate has those slots open up. Oh, okay. Okay. Hopefully that's... Done. You ran the way, Kumba. You ran the way. You ran the way.
should do this more often. I'm not freaking colour these in. I'm so confused as how this file is working. What are you trying to colour in? This layer. Which layer? This layer that I'm flicking on and off. Oh, that um, that has a colour overlay on it, I think. It doesn't say it does. Is does it inside it inside of a group it does? Oh, uh, is the group only this? Yeah. single fucking thing this entire six days dude I feel like I could murder you in your sleep murder you in your sleep Swear, man. What is it? Just filled this layer in. I like it. Swifty at 10 p.m. I want to eat tangerines. (laughs) Swifty at midnight. I will murder you in your sleep. (laughs) It's a fine line between the two. But I'll murder you in your sleep For eating my tangerines You'll fucking die now I hope you packed the extra fruit Cause I'm gonna starve Your tangerine you tree of you? water
Some of the colours behave so strangely, I'm not sure why. Probably because it's something that you've put on them, I'm assuming. Which ones? Like this guy's colour? Yeah, he's got something over the top of him. What's he got? Where is it? It's probably, look for a locked layer. It's over the three of them, I think. Oh, there. Yeah. I like that you've shattered them all, that's cool. Yeah, basically just trying to draw more attention to what's happening in front of them rather than fading everyone else out. Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna send it back to you. This isn't how I want it, but hopefully this has helped simplify some stuff. <coughs> I don't know what you wanna do with the background. Maybe you could do something abstract with it. I'll do something abstract with yeah. it. Yeah, at the minute I've just put a gradient in, um, but you could, you could do whatever. Okay. Like, you could have it dark, but I think it depends what you want to go for. When it's dark, it becomes harder to read the foreground characters. Should I just save it? Yeah. Are you happy with that? Oh uh, yeah. Like the changes I've made. I miss the black lightning, but and the black thing around shadow. But I agree, he's a lot easier to see. So I'm um, I'm gonna defer to what you've done. Well, you can always try bringing it back and see how it looks with the new other changes. Did you delete the layer? No, I just turned I just put the turned it visibility off. Okay. That's all. Cool. Yeah, I basically just wanted to simplify right down. Save it as a version, just just to be just. To oh, care. I just press save on it. Okay. Cool. Yeah, basically, what's what are we focusing on? What's in the midground, foreground, background? Weird that it didn't do the dun dun thing. I think Tracer should be working, but I can double check it. Yeah, double check. Okay. There it goes. I got it. Cool. Is that after you hit the button? Yeah. What the singer in the prior tangerine song neglected to mention in their everyday routine? How <laughs> much you in your sleep with a tangerine? Yes! Yes! Okay, let's see. Let's get this flyer done. Highway Dogging Square for stream on animation at Animation Breakfast Club every weekday morning from 8 ish to 10 ish a.m. UK time. What else do we need to put? Come see our amazing 3D setup. I just need a cool screenshot of one of the streams, basically. It's actually pretty hard to find screenshots of our stream. So unhinged looking. <laughs> Risen Demon, hello That's again. So... Thank you so much for your, for your subscription. How are you doing? You pooed your pants when you first saw the girl movie. I also did. My parents told me I wasn't allowed to watch it, so I snuck out the VHS when they weren't watching. 
when they were away and I watched it by myself and I had to stop it like 20 minutes in because I was too scared. I can grab more from the descriptors if you feel like it. Pal, thank you. Have a look. We're a bird and bear who live in a stolen airship. We've got this toy and this from Unity and can half in the twitches back in. And it half in the twitch back in, so check the transmissions. That's really good. It's really unhinged. Hold on, I'm gonna... That, I don't feel like that's a good... <laughs> I mean, it's good, but... What? I like when you get up and... You remember you were saying about that thing where like, you spend a lot of your time, you know, sitting, then you just want to be free? Yes. I didn't believe you until this moment. I told you. I didn't believe you until this moment. I told you. I want to be doing anything else other than sitting right now. on you guys I'm on the last bits of color what do you think of this moment for shadow it's you what do you think I like it cool. do you feel like you could just have to say that you like it or do you actually like it I feel like it doesn't feel like the same color the same uh, light source as the window because it's so much more orange in the window yes which is what threw me when i first looked and why i hesitated okay. it's because looking at the panel above and trying to work out yeah it's dramatic lighting rather than i can make it more like that but it felt too cold i mean maybe you could do it make it like that but then give it a um a orange edge towards the left over here towards the left this is the right now what's the point to be alone but i accept you without you that be no home i done wrong in the past but i was fighting in the dark and i won't hold my feelings back anymore me like you used to anymore you don't have to wait anymore I'm holding on to feelings that I'm more around what's that fucking chill dude huh? chill me? hey Kuma, tell just chill yeah dude, I played with you a bunch you I've also played with you a bunch you gotta, you gotta let us get on a little bit Kuma can't live under cuteness forever.
Okay, let's see. Hop a dup a dup a dup. Do we use controllers? We do, yeah. Um, I can give you a little example. I don't have my face tracking on, so I have to excuse the fact that my mouth and stuff doesn't work. But yeah, oh, it got a bit stuck to me. Ah, aha. Yeah. Ta da! This is how we do it. Except normally the faces work too. But my iPad is currently being used for inspiration. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oops, let me get out of the way of that. There you go. Now you can see what I'm doing better. Eh, eh, there we go. Thanks very much. We actually, um, we started doing it a couple of years ago, but since we started, a couple of our friends have started making their own too. So if you want any recommendations for other people doing similar things, the Space Pirate Fenrir is doing it. Gwillim's doing it. Uh, Rene is doing it. Rene was here. Uh, there's, there's a bunch of people. Rene right here. Thank you. Yeah, basically, Doig is a game developer. At some point, he was like, why don't we just build that but for Twitch? And so he did it. Yo, there's Spice Pirate Femme right now. Hey, yo. So, yeah, I'm currently trying to make a little flyer because we're going to a convention this weekend. And I want to tell people that we exist. But I'm not the best at making them even though I'm trying very hard to oh my gosh one of the videos of us is of three days ago and it literally has upload November 7th it's literally a screenshot of right now <laughs> really? that's so weird yeah what the heck I mean, this one's so boring, but maybe it's like the best thing we can do. Look. Like, this one feels boring, right? So I'll see you there is right up. that's okay I can move it we can, we can move it to like here and just have the little tail be different oh thanks Ben I think you deleted the layer that had the black on I don't think I did I didn't delete anything. found it. I'm glad.
Do, do, do. I mean, what do you guys think to this? Oh, when can you get the comic we're, we're done? We're going to take it to a convention this weekend. And then, after we've been at the convention, we're going to bring back any copies that we still have and pop them up on our shop. We'll try and make the price as low as possible, so it'll probably be £5 each. And then they'll be shipping. But hopefully they won't be expensive, because they're just comics. Um... So yeah, that's it. But I hope that we sell a lot of them. I don't know if we will, but the important thing is that we'll have something on our table. Something new on our table. Yeah. That's the point. Well, I definitely didn't get that twerk print done. That would have been easier. Yeah. Why didn't we do that? <laughs> I've tried. You tried? I did. I like this brush. This is a nice brush. I'll be using this again. What do you think to this, Mike? Yeah, I like that. Did you see it properly and read it and stuff? Yeah. The unhinged time is pretty good. Yeah, I think that works. I like that. Okay. I mean, the screenshot of us is. If you can find a better one. Kind of static, yeah. Right? Let me know if you can find a better one, though. Well, I wonder if you could grab one of Martina's thumbnails from. They the all have dates on them. Mm. Yeah. Sorry. Our cat is, is going to the toilet very loudly. Wonderful here. These thumbnails are so good. It's Martina's thumbnails are just amazing. I just found a We Love Twitch thumbnail, which I think is sarcastic. <laughs> good it's 
demon has visited us. Okay, let me check it out. Sorry, did I miss what you said? I thought you said Risen Demon said they have a suggest. They have a su suggest. <laughs> the stink demon has visited us. Oh, okay. Sorry. I'll be right back. Maybe if I move, you will see up. I will be out of the way. Camera. You like that picture and it doubles as advertising our merch. Okay, well, it's better than the other one, isn't it? So at least it's that. Thank you for the confirm on that. Gosh, that's smelly. <laughs> yeah, and it's gone. Jesus. I merely moved the air towards Jesus. you. Jesus. I told you, the stink demon. Jesus. The oh stink my demon, God. dude. <laughs> dude. The stink demon. For clarity, our cat shit. That's what we're talking about. Neither, it's not us. What do you think of this? Um. It's much better than it was, I think. Yeah. I think it's it's at least much more readable and clear. Yeah. I think. I think we could go with that. Are you happier with it? I'm happy with it. Like maybe that guy in the very background between Cream and the Bumblebee. Yeah. You could maybe fade his legs a little bit. Or brush over with him a little bit or something, so he's separated from their silhouettes. Because right now that's getting a little tangled. Okay. Okay, can you NDA me, please? Thank. I'm just saving this as a PDF. Okay, thanks. So you're saying what to do what to this guy? Uh, maybe fade his legs a little bit. <laughs> okay.
Oh my gosh, I will go murder those cats. I'm gonna go murder them. I'll do it. Kuma, Lord help me. I'm murdering him. I'm murdering him. Ow! I hit myself against the desk. I did successfully murder Kuma though, so good, you know, good for me. Like they can sense we're stressed, and they're like, "You're stressed, or I'm stressed." Please do not the cat. Okay. So, how many leaflets do you want? 150? No, ch check more. Like. If we're just giving these things out, yeah, we'll need a fair few. Two hundred. I'm thinking like five hundred. Five hundred. We want people to know. What do you guys think? We're gonna end up with so many unused leaflets. It's too late, guys. He's dead now. I murdered him. He deserved it. I threw a tangerine at him so hard that he exploded. <laughs> Are you talking about me or Kuma? Kuma. How big is the con? That's a good, that's a good, uh, yeah. All right, hang on. <laughs> Sorry, you're not seeing anything now. Uh, thought bubble. Thought bubble. Uh, attendance 2022 you see the thing is that these leaflets are going to be useful but I don't have faith that you're not going to want to redesign them or change them before right. we go to another con okay so it's like I don't want to have a bunch of leaflets lying around so if we can get rid of all of them that'd be great According to this, attendance is around about 13,000 people. Mm -hmm. And how many people do we normally get at a table per Thought Bubble? It's true. 500 would probably 500 do it. probably. How much does 500 cost? Uh, 60 something. 300. We could get 300. How much does 300 cost? 50 pounds. 49 pounds. For 300 get 300 no i'm saying for for 300 yeah. it's that it's 16 pence per leaflet for 300 yeah i don't know if he says i would bring too many it sucks to run out and you can use them at the next con but what i think is going to happen is that we'll get too many and then they'll we'll come back and put them in the cupboard then do will want to get different ones for the next con and so they'll just sit there unused forever. And every time we look at them, we'll have like 100, 200 leaflets in there. We can give them away when we can put them in when people buy stuff off the store. I guess. So. I, how, okay, here's, here's the deal then. Mm -hmm. We don't give them out. We just let people take them. Yeah. That way we'll need less. Because we'll push them less. That's what I was going to do anyway. Yeah. Would well, you want to do 350? Do you have unused previous leaflets? We've never had leaflets. So. Yeah, we've never had them before. Just put them in random mailboxes. How much is it for 500? It's 60. 69, I think. 69. 500. 67. So it's a difference of like 20 quid almost. Mm -hmm. Or 200 more. I don't know. If you don't think they're good enough to use again, then well, I, I, I'm, I'm on board with what you think. We kind of rushed it, didn't we? Yeah. Let's do 350. Okay. I'm <laughs> QR code of why I was about to print it with the old QR code. That doesn't Don't do, do that. I randomly picked that off Google. I know, I know, I know. That's what I'm saying. 
Okay, here we are. I'm at the upload artwork step, so I need to actually put the proper QR code in. I can't stress this enough. Up and the shot. So where was where was it? That I know keep it. Oh I see it, here we are. <laughs> what Eric says, here's another QR code. Don't worry about where it goes. <laughs> So would you rather have the website or the link tree? I was just about to ask you the same question. Which do you think is more useful? I think the link tree is, but... Okay, let's do the link tree then. Okay. Test it, Doig. Uh, uh, sure. Have you got it on screen? Yeah. Can I show your screen? Yeah. He's just up on the unit looking at me and scratching at your bar. Oh no, Ellie says I have a bunch of flight path sticker sheets and I want to give them away to all you cool people but I can't ask people for their mailing addresses and I don't blame them for not being good for giving it to me so huh? Oh no! Oh no, I don't totally know how to solve that problem. It works. Oh, yeah. I don't know how to solve that problem. Uploading the files now. You took my, uh, yeah, it's fine. It's yes. fine. I, I did. did. I took yeah. much of your. <laughs> you did. I liked how it made the tags pop on the bottom. Uh-huh. It's fine. It's good. Love you. Also, you misspelled people. <laughs> That's okay. Popel, right? Popel is good. Hey, Blue Pino. We are trying to get a comic done for tomorrow, and getting leaflets made and sent off to a printer's. Oh, hey, Blupino. We're slowly going mad. Aha. Mm Right, what else can we do? We got booklet printing, we got business cards, postcards, stickers and labels. You want to go sleep. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Loyalty cards. 
loyalty card. Yeah. Are you just looking at what digital printing does now? Yeah. <laughs> oh wait, you wanted to get the banner. Oh yeah. Do you have that uh, somewhere I can get? I don't know how they're gonna send a banner to us in time. I don't know. I don't even remember what kind of one we got last time. They do same day roll up stands. Um, it was a me I got the one that was a meter, I think, across. A meter. Yeah. Okay. So, let me. I've got 800 millimeters wide and a thousand millimeters wide. I think it's a thousand. And 1,200. And 1,500. I think it's a 1,001. Okay. A full meter wide. Yeah. I thought it would go for a wide, wide boy. Wide boy. Wide boy. <laughs> Sorry. Yeah, okay. I just need to edit Patrick out. And I think this is done. Oh, here we go. Order within 16 hours for a Thursday dispatch. 16 hours. Yep, yeah, so what's 16 hours from now? 5 p.m. For a Thursday dispatch. That seems optimistic of them. Yeah. 5 p.m. for them in the UK and they can still send it that day. Wow. After receiving the files and printing them. 5 p.m. would be... Yeah, 5 p.m. Yeah, wow. Like, they must do stuff overnight. And But they said they're sending it on... Oh, because tomorrow's Wednesday. Yeah. I see. I am dumb. I thought I thought to, I thought today was Wednesday, and they were saying that they could receive something on Thursday at 5 p.m., <gasps> print it, <gasps> and then send it the same day. <laughs> yeah, I know. Okay. I'm just going to go and check out... The saddle stitched stuff again to see if that's now updated. Yes, yeah, so that's the same. Order within 16 hours, 46 minutes for a Thursday dispatch. Oh, they fixed it. Yeah. Cool. So that's our time frame. So we have to get stuff sent before 5 p.m. tomorrow in order to get it dispatched. On Thursday. On Thursday. To arrive on Friday. I mean, do you know that if they dispatch it on Thursday, it will arrive on Friday? No. But you, I think you can get next day delivery. If there, if, I think you can pay extra for next day delivery. Okay. So dispatch means it goes out of their warehouse. That day. Don't solve any problem with... So one, uh, one banner would be seventy pounds. Okay. So are you going to be happy enough with this banner to pay seventy pounds for it? I think so. Yeah. We're going to use it a lot. Yeah, that's why I'm checking that you're happy with the work you've done on it. Wow, Patrick's work on it. Yeah, I think this would be pretty cool. What do you, what does everybody think? I think so. I'm just, I'm just taking Patrick, second Patrick out. Okay. Did we ask Patrick's permission to use this? Yes, we did. Okay, good. <laughs> yeah, he gave his express permission. In fact, he told us we should sell his stuff as prints at our table. And we said, no, Patrick, we wouldn't be comfortable literally having your work on our table and just selling it. So we're just giving it away for free instead. So, what is the leaflet? At least people are like, we're not making money off his work. Oh, Alex says there are forwarding services that exist, like in the USA and elsewhere. You can have someone mail something to a US 
a UPS store and UPS forwards it to you without the sender knowing your address. What a hassle over free stickers, yeah. If only we could just stick paper into the internet and teleport it, right? Yeah. Damn. Like, I mean, like, you could have it just as an opt-in thing where you're like, you know, free stickers to people who want flight path stickers. You just have to enter this anonymous thing to give me your, not anonymous, enter this private thing to give me your address you, and I'll send it to you. Did you say like or Mike? Because I heard Mike. I, I don't really remember saying like. I think I'm too tired to know what I'm saying anymore. Okay, I'm always too tired. Everyone leave. <laughs> I mean, why? you could always stop streaming. No. <laughs> Do Doink's not going to move or stop streaming. You all just have to leave. Oh, we've got something here that says... This product cannot be added to your cart as you already have an express production product in your cart. Oh, so you can't get more than one express production. That makes sense. Does it? Not really. Let me go and put the other two. If we order the two things, other things tonight, we might not need express. Yeah. So let me yeah, do that. Should have done that earlier. Should have done what earlier? Order them. Yeah, we were planning to do it last week. But yeah. the things which we went to pre last week weren't ready. Isn't that right, dog? No. I don't know how to get back to my car. <laughs> Help me, I need to order this. Let me pay for them, please. Oh my gosh. <laughs> God. Hey, luckily, your dad was able to help us. Yeah. <laughs> How the fuck do I get to my basket again? I don't know that. Can you NDA me? Yeah burning out his content Look. okay just a scroll my my screen is too bright for me to be able to see all the details and stuff so is I that you still it. using that yeah fucking thing okay i don't need express production Edit order. Okay, this patch Thursday, that's fine. Because the rest of the stuff will be dispatched Thursday anyway, so that's perfectly fine. So, that didn't require expressing it, or...? To order on Thursday. To for, sorry, for it to be dispatched on Thursday. Yeah. No, it didn't, because we're ordering it tonight. So they're yeah. probably going to print it tomorrow morning. And then send it, right? Okay, sweet. If it comes to it, we might need to pretend we're different people. Why? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I don't what know. the fuck are you talking I don't about? Know. <laughs> if it comes to it, if it's if it's a bridge we have to cross, should we have thought bubble? Get the hats and coats. We didn't make out. this. 
<laughs> We're not talking Smith. What the fuck are you didn't talking know. about? What? what? See Who? It? See us in the other hall. Yeah, you must have the wrong people. <laughs> Where is the fun to give Swifty a bottle of chloroform to knock out Doig? <laughs> he's gone. I don't know what he's talking about. <laughs> no, sh he's fucking lost it. I've lost it. See you, Blue Pino. You got to go prep for video interview. That's awesome. Good luck. You'll be great. Don't worry about it. You're gonna rock it and be awesome. Have fun. Wee! Thank you for swinging by the stream. Well, 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 well. Who are you? How many dog books about how to redeem to get Swifty to drop kick Doig in the chest and shut the stream <laughs> down for the evening? None. I've got good news for you, Benry. Zero Doigle books. Lawrence, Lair, thank you so much for the raid. Is it a big one? Yeah, it is. Hello. Thank you so much. Is it a big one? Sorry, I'm my, sorry. My inhibitions are turning off. He's You're so, just hearing my inner thoughts now. So fucking tired. We've been going for way too long. You may think six hours, that's not so long. This is part two of a stream that decided it was going to balk out. Um... So yeah, welcome. It's great to have you here. What were you guys up to? We are crunching, trying to get stuff ready for a convention this weekend. We have to order things uh, from the printers by tomorrow uh, in order to get things on time. So I'm just sending orders off to the printer tonight that we can get done. And Doug is trying to finish off our 10 page comic book that we've absolutely blitzed together in the last five days. Hey, not bad, eh? Look, look. There was a goat, and now there's no goat. Where the fuck did the goat goat go? I fucking painted him out, dude. Holy shit. Okay, make sure that you're happy with everything, because no take backsies. Blend anything you need to blend. Yeah, thank you very much, Lawrence Lair. Yeah, what were you guys doing? Thank you, Lovesick, for the cow chops. <laughs> now he can't leave the stream even if he tried. He's going for content and statistics. Oh, that's the worst. <laughs> Shortly after his photo was taken, 50 spontaneously combusted. That's the sound. We do live cartoon adventures and shenanigans. What? That sounds amazing. That sounds exactly like the kind of thing I would love to see. Let me go and give you a follow. If if there are any mods here, which there may not be, please um, give Lawrence there a shout out. Oh my gosh, this looks delightful. I love the look of this. I'm going like to follow you. really loudly there. Don't shout really loudly. We still have neighbours. Lauren. They haven't all moved away yet. Are they aware? Oh, thanks, pal. Thank you. What have you done? What? <laughs> Patrick's cool fire that he drew is gone and scrungled and it's got half your butt stuck to it oh that that's it's oh, see-through oh it's see-through i just thought you'd done a bad not done a bad yeah, but it looks fine yeah i can't eat yet <laughs> one by one our neighbors will realize that we're streamers and they'll move they're too loud, too late at night. When did it get to be half past 1 a.m.? I know, I know, I know. I know. Do you feel a little bit better knowing that you just have to get in before five though? Yeah, you could get a, a night's sleep, Mike, and do a little bit more tomorrow. Yeah? I want it to be done today though. 
I know you do, love, but you're really tired and it's 1.30. And we just have to get in before 5pm tomorrow. And then they'll dispatch it on Thursday. That's what they say on the website. You can have a double check yourself if you want. Okay. Have a Jaffa cake. Lawrence there, do you do you know Jaffa cakes? Are you familiar? I'm gonna send this to you. You can buy it. Yes, yeah, send it to me and I will buy it. This is gonna go behind us. Yeah. Uh huh. Yeah, that's the idea. Do you want to put the QR code on it? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> that's why we were do. That's why. We're, ooh, that's why we're making this. Mm. I left a space for it. Mhm. Mm go on then. Where do I get it from? Uh, so you want to go to a dog swifting Discord? You love Jaffa's. They're hard to find in the States where you're at. Awesome. Is it a lot of people in the US have never tried them. So I'm happy that you are one of the... Don't worry people. about where it goes. Who sent that? Who do I have to kill? Which link tree? We're going for the link tree one, right? Yeah. I have to remember to also replace your advert in my comic pages. I might actually just go do that now. Actually, this file's linked, so it should auto replace. Should. How did you get it to be so big? <laughs> I uh, scaled it up, dog. It's a little trick I call scaling things up that aren't vectors. I know that it makes you shrivel into your skin whenever I do it, but sometimes it's necessary. There's a QR code! I know he made that for us today. How can I scale it up without? You can do like nearest neighbor. How do I select that? I think it's in the scale options, isn't it? Yeah, maybe. maybe I need to go into. Lawrence last had lived in the UK for a minute and discovered all the delicious sweets. Oh, what was your favorite? Just for a minute. Just for a minute. Oh. That's all it took. And then, and then they were like, you know what? Screw this. I'm going back to the US where it's nice and sunny most of the time. Where's the transform tool? Control T. Oh, interpolation. So I want nearest neighbor. What are Jaffa cakes like? They're really nice. They're soft little cakes. Um, you know, about the size of a cookie. And they have a little slice of orange jelly on top of them, and then the top of it's coated in chocolate. Uh, so it's kind of crunchy, but then you bite in this jelly inside and a soft cake bottom. And they're just really tasty, chocolatey and orangey. But the, the like jelly stuff in the middle is really like fresh tasting. What do you think of this sort of placement? I think that's that's good. I think it might be a little bit big for my taste. How big would you want it? Maybe like here? Yeah. Hold on, zoom out. I want to see the whole thing. There we go. I think right in the corner again. Yeah, I think I like it better next to Doig and Swift than I do in the corner. What do you think? Yeah. Okay. Besides Jaffa Cakes, you love the bird's custard. All the biscuits and tea. Also love your porridge. It's not the same in the US. Oh, that's interesting. I didn't know that. Bird's eye custard is like, oh, it's so good. <laughs> I love custard, man. Custard's amazing. You like it with less white like this? Uh huh. Or more white? I think I like it with more. I yeah, like it's a statement. But I think you could scale it down a little bit. 
Just scale it down there, Doig. No, because I've been using it nearest neighbor. Do it one time. Porridge is not the tastiest sounding word, it's true. How small? Up a little bit. Up a little bit. Yeah, I think that's fine. And then make sure it's lined up properly. Kanye Art says more white for impacto also. Impacto. Silencio impacto. Yay! Okay, I'm gonna save this where you can get it. Mm -hmm. Please do. I'll save as. Uh, should I take off the. I'll take off the, the thing when I save it. Um, save as. <laughs> Derp says now you can end stream. I'll see if I can convince him. Leave the markup, roll up. Gold 1000 stand up markup. Dog Swift. Okay. And you've made sure that the QR code in the in the comic is gonna be different. Gonna be changed. I haven't checked that yet. I'm gonna check it once I get this order off. Okay, I've saved it. It's going into the same folder as the leaflet was. Mm -hmm. Thank you for handling the printing website. You're welcome. So, uh, where am I looking? Uh, it's just in uh, the not the color, uh, not the colors folder, but like. Comic pages, thought bubble, and then it, yep. it's the first file really. It says gold 1000 roll up stand mock up dog swift. Okay, I don't see it in there yet, so I have to wait a little bit. It's very big, so it might take a little bit. Okay, that's all right. I will wait. F I will wait for it. I will wait 1,000 miles to be the man who waited 1,000 miles to be right here for when you arrived. So this stuff is being sent on Thursday. Okay. Which means it will arrive on Friday. Yep. So we need to make a call about where we're getting it sent. I think we get it sent here and the reason being is that we technically don't have to leave here until later like, on later on yeah okay. so if need to be one of us can wait and the well other if one not mum's gonna be here watching the cats once we've left that's right yeah so I can always ask my dad if he's gonna be Coming by Harrogate, maybe he could pick them up from here. Okay. Like, yeah. without giving away our geography, I don't know if that's on the way or not, but you would. I will tell you later. You can give me a thumbs up or a thumbs down. Okay. Now I know what we're doing. Aha! It is here. The gold 1000 roll up stand mock up doing swift. <laughs> yeah. So I want this as a PDF, correct? Uh, no idea. Probably. 
probably. Can you not just upload PDFs? Yes, please. I don't know if I Maybe? I don't know if I made it um, CMYK for that one. Should should I change it? I don't know. Probably. Probably. It might dull it out, which is uh, sad, but that one's probably. Actually, that was probably an RGB file from. from, from, from uh. Let's see what the damage is. Oof. Is it very bad? It is. Should we just try putting it in RGB? Yeah, maybe. What did it do? <laughs> is that in CMYK now? Mm -hmm. Oh, it got rid of the... Oh. Look at oh. this. And now I'm going to undo it. Ready? Yeah. Oh. Do, do it back again. Why did it make our logo not white? I don't know. I mean, it's still a beautiful drawing. It is still beautiful. But all the vibrancy is gone. Yeah. We could just send it in RGB and hope. Yeah. Okay. What am I doing? I'm saving it as a PDF. You're welcome. You cannot save it. Okay. You cannot right. save it. That's what it says. Can you send it as a I don't know. Let me have a look. Uh. Yeah. Then we were dancing on wire. I have to say, I appreciate everyone who's kind of come by and kind of looked out for us and made sure we're okay and like, given us advice and been telling us that we can rest and everything. Appreciate yeah, it. thank you. It's nice. Sorry to worry you. Yeah, so uh, roll up on a check checklist. Outlook is at 300 DPI. I'm assuming it is. Yeah. CMYK color profile. No. Okay. All fonts embedded. Don't know what that means. Uh, it means that if you have a font on there you want printed that it's embedded in the file, but our thing is like a vector thing anyway, or it's it's not a font, so it's So it, it doesn't tell me what format that it needs. Hmm. Well, let me check. What was the reason it said it couldn't couldn't save it? No reason. You you were there. It just said cannot save. Too big for the PDF format. That makes no sense. Saving. A hey, shambling mound. PDF. Like I said, you ever get a feeling when all of your body turns on at the exact same time? I'm losing my goddamn mind right now. I don't get that feeling. I don't know what that means. Sorry, Rio. It's like 140 for us right now. We're just trying to send stuff off to the printers, but everything is being so okay. difficult. Try... Um, uncheck save as optimizes for fast web view and then save the combined file. Oops. Wait. Oh, that is what I wanted. I want to save as. I just want on my computer. Okay, what am I doing? See if there's something that's like saving, if there's an option for 
save as optimized for fast yes. view. Yes, untick that. Untick that. Is that it? Yeah, that should fix it. Could not save. Oh. I got no clue, dude. Take turn off layers. Turn off layers, how? Let me come over. <laughs> Remove preserve Photoshop editing capabilities. Thing into a new flat and then save that. Probably. Try it. Without select. I think so. Control A. It did. Control Shift C. New. Save as. PDF. Uh, maybe that's why. I mean, just, uh, maybe it is. Um, shit. This one. I think maybe it's a space thing. Don't save it into that folder, then save it in the next folder. Okay, here we go again. Yep. Love you too. Okay, so I'll save it here. saving yeah maybe you just try <laughs> <coughs> it, is, it is not wanting me to do it kind of uh, issues that you run into. The day of printing always happens just inexplicably. I can turn it to CMYK. Um, yeah, but does it still look like ass? Yeah. But at least the logo doesn't go grey. <laughs> For next is enthralling stream content, sorry. We just, uh, we have to open a lot of files and go in a lot of folders to fix, try and fix this. And we've got a lot of NDA stuff on our computer that we can't risk showing. Welcome to printing. It's awful. Ah, I hate it. You're very invested. Thanks, Mr. U. I appreciate it. I, I'm invested. I just want it to work. We would encourage you to upload print-ready PDF files. 
Is there going to be an issue about the fact that they say that the maximum size we can send is 200 megabytes per file? What's that? It says maximum size 200 megabytes per file on the website. That might be an issue for this. Yeah. Well, surely we got around it with the other one. And better news, you got tacos. Nice job. Maybe I can get Dolly the burrito tomorrow to make him feel better. save them you've been able to save them yeah i've saved one uh i'm sure happy wow they're like 84 megabytes and 49 so there's one that's rgb and there's one that's not well which one do you want i don't know i would rather the vibrancy of the rgb but if they say cmyk then that's what it is in cmyk I well don't i mean the thing is, if you send them an RGB file, yeah, it's going to get printed in CMYK. Yeah. So it might end up looking like the CMYK, say CMYK file anyway. Like, what's the difference between sending them an RGB file that gets printed in CMYK and sending them a CMYK file that gets printed in CMYK? What's the actual difference? Sure, I could bump the saturation on the seat on the um to compensate maybe on the CMYK version. Well, that's up to you. From when I've tried to bump uh saturation on CMYK images, they often just stay about the same brightness or saturation they always were because the super bright stuff that I wanted has become that anyway you know yeah I think it still looks okay in, in the reference to itself like um here so it sounds like, yeah, people are saying basically that um, the reason to send it in CMYK is that you get a better idea of how it's going to print and can control it better from your end. Because you can do what you're doing now and tweak the values and the vibrancy to make it as good as you want it. Right. Whereas you have no control if you send it in RGB, it's just going to come out how it comes out. Yeah. But if you look at it in CMYK, you can tweak it first to get it as close as you can. Thank you for the advice, everyone. Yeah, I don't think we're going to get those blues. To be honest. We're not going to get those blues. We're just going to have to deal with the fact that we're not going to get them. Sometimes if you shift to see the hue, like some things print better, like that color prints better than the darker blue, for example. You can just get more vibrancy with it. It loses a little bit of something, but it does look better, generally. Yeah. Thank you, Dark Vault. Thank you, everyone, for all of the um, for all of the advice, sir. Uh, Derp, snazzy, carny art. You guys are great.
that's the thing is like CMYK is cyan magenta yellow and black so if there was one color I feel like would be unaffected it would be magenta right like I feel like magenta should be able to just print pure and bright that's better Let go of Shadow the Hedgehog set releases next month. There's a bad Nick Shadow Containment Tube on his bike. With I like that you get his containment tube. Of all the things Shadow would want to bring with him in the Lego set, his containment tube, I would think, wouldn't have been one of them. He's like, why did you put this in my set? Yeah, it's the brightness that print fails to capture, says Carney Art. It will depend a bit on the quality of machines being printed on, also. That's definitely a better dog. I'm gonna encourage you to do your changes quickly. Yeah. Because I feel like the longer we leave it. No, I get you. I'm, I'm thinking I'm gonna send you this. Yeah, the more chance that it's gonna tick over into a Thursday dispatch instead. Yeah. Sorry, Friday dispatch instead. That's fair. Okay, I'm gonna say. You decided not to alter the jelly cat? Yeah, because I noticed that um, it's not, it's, it's pretty. <laughs> I made it too vibrant, so... I I'm liked it. It's very hard to see there. Okay. Can you not just redo? No. Whoa! Kazuhiro Samadesu is raiding with Pipe 6. Thank you so much for the raid. I said whoa because I'm surprised at how many raids we have today. Thank you guys very much. How was your stream and welcome in. We sure are still going. <laughs> but only just. I'm, I'm encouraging Doi to end the stream and step away. But we'll see how he feels. You came in with a Thor raid. Was that really that long ago? Oh my gosh, we're still going guys. Help me me what were you up to on your stream Good stream. Yeah, I'm good with that. You were going through Dark Souls for the first time. It's harrowing. Sounds like it's an amazing game, though. I've never played it, but Doik has. A lot of our friends have, and everyone's like, holy shit, Dark Souls is great. Take me higher. <laughs> not save. Now you've got the could not save too. I thought you said you already saved it. Hi. Can you not overwrite it? I am not. Oh my gosh. Did you finish the comic? Not quite. We figured out that our deadline for print is 5pm tomorrow. So Doig was wanting to stay up all night to finish the comic. So to keep streaming essentially. And I'm trying to encourage him since we have till 5 p.m. tomorrow to sleep and hit again in the morning. Thanks for asking. 
now our task is just trying to send off this banner that we've been working on. You've been there on both sides, you sure have. Do we have anything else going on tomorrow? Just a comic, just a comic. Especially if we can get all this stuff sent off today. Then the only thing we're sending off for print tomorrow is the comic. Is it a space issue for you as well, do you Might think? Be a space issue for me. We keep running into this weird error with saving the file. And we think it's probably that our computers are running low on space. not letting me in. It won't let me, it won't make, let me paste in this. Yeah. Like it comes in different. Okay. That makes no sense to me. It doesn't make any sense. Oh wait, I figured it out. Let me see, what can I get rid of? on my computer to free myself up more space so I can do things. Why won't it fucking let me save this? I have no... It must be a space thing. Yeah, it's not letting me save anything else either. Yeah. I think it's just, I think it's just a space thing. I think it's probably uh, my C drive is too full to take it. So how do we free up space is now the question. Why does it have to be so difficult? <laughs> Sorry, I think I'm almost got it. I'm just purging and then I'm gonna um, try and save. Okay, purging is taking a little bit. Mm -hmm. We are sleepy, as sleepy as can be. Yeah, I'm pretty sleepy.
purge doesn't let me purge. <sighs> Are you done? Okay. Oh. Save as. Um. Banner. Dark Swift. save this how do I even like is it all in my downloads folder no it can't be I made a new downloads folder that was was not on my C drive Closing Photoshop and reopening. Check my space on my scene. There we now. are. I saved it. You know what I did? What? I uninstalled Sea of Thieves. Nice. Do you know how big that is? 50, 60 gigs or 100 something? gigs. Okay. And you installed it to see? I guess I must have. Like a very, Like a very smart person. Mistake. Like an incredibly smart person. So you saved it. So I saved what? The banner. No, I closed the banner because I was trying to figure out what's going on with my computer. But you said I saved it. Is that more like? No, I, I said I, I did it. I deleted it. Oh, okay. I. I Got, I got space back. Wow, I remember that my clipboard was this is fucking stupid.
Any luck on your end? I'm about to try. God, we're both so dead. <laughs> We're also like, uh, not it's streaming NDA for this entire time as well. Yeah, sorry guys about that. We don't want to be. It's just. I, I think mean, you that could probably did it. you could probably share my screen now if you wanted. Okay, I'm sending you one that's called Banner Test CMYK, a PDF. <laughs> Thanks. Uh, I can share your screen, you said? Yeah, you can share my screen if you want. Okay. Oh, let me just find Unity and turn off the thing. Curious how that's as vibrant. Is that a C that's a RGB? RGB? Okay, I'm not too worried about it. Yeah, I mean, I should okay. convert it over. What happens if I merge? I can always undo it. It's okay. Yeah. Okay. okay so that's the interior cover. Um, I can take that off, I can take that off. Uh, did you put it somewhere I could get it? Yeah. Where it's did in, you put it? It's in the comics folder, the root of where we've been sharing comics folders on sync. Okay. I'm looking for a PDF. Yeah, it's called Banner Dog Swift CMY. Okay. Think Tracer. Ah, so now you are in the bed camp, are you? So banner test or a different one? opening it to make sure. Where do we get the QR code? Ayanoki made it for us. Yeah. Yeah? Okay. It's uploading! Oh my god! Yeah. Yeah, Sea of Thieves is 100 gigs. It was over 100 gigs. I was like, well, that sure freed up a chunk, didn't it? Jeez, oh. Remind me to never install any games on my computer ever again. Yeah, Doig, so are you feeling like you're going to go to bed, get some rest, and then hit the pages fresh tomorrow? I think so. Awesome. You're so close, dude. That's why I'm, like, reluctant. But it means that you shouldn't have any problem getting them done tomorrow, so... Yeah, I'll get them done before five. Mm-hmm. Okay. Okay, let's let's sleep on it then. Once, yeah. Once you've sent this order off. Okay. It's processing. Bunch of people could raid. 
there's Fahrenheit, there's Barry, there's Enemy, there's Sagi, there's Paper Box House, there's Jonah Vasquez, there's Schillin, Spatula, Lubberfin, Devon. So many people. See what again? There's, oh, Dorig! Fuck off! All right, let's see. Uh, three of those, 350 of those, one of those. We've qualified for free delivery. Yes, because the one you briefly had on the cover led somewhere else, but I guess you're using that as a placeholder. Oh yeah. Briefly had on the cover, what do you mean? The one that um, we had on the image. The, the, the placeholder one that was... The leaflet. Yeah, the I'm leaflet. just checking what Eric means by the cover. Whether he means the large banner you just made, the flyer that's on my screen, or the page that's in the book of the flyer. I think the one that's in the book of the flyer. But it ended up leading to the right place, right? No, the one that... The one that he probably tried that was inside the book is probably bad. They should all lead to the same place now, though. So this one should lead to our link tree. Let me test it for you. And what about this one? What one's this? This is the one inside the book. That's wrong. That's wrong. That's going to be wrong. It shouldn't be. Weird. Okay, well, I'll just paste that one over the top of it then, I guess. Okay, so if we get. Friday from 9am to 5.30pm It'll just cost us £7 So I'll do that To get it delivered to us, Mike Yeah? Yeah? Cool Yeah? Okay Almost says it's going to come Friday that's what it says right here. Yeah? Okay. yeah? <laughs> There's so many years going back across. I just want to really make sure that I'm getting it right. Because I'm so scared that I'm going to do the wrong thing. That I need Doi to like Sani to check things for me. Thanks a lot, Eric. I appreciate that you noticed that. We're lucky this isn't one of the ones we're printing today. So this is one for that deliver here yeah I think so yeah okay. like yeah, yeah. Do that. filling details save as before Just what I feel things, and I'm staring at Doig to check that I'm like doing it right. Why does it not have state problems? I don't know. Is this what we're thinking? Uh, yeah, I think so. I'm just checking over the final details with Mike.
Yeah? Okay, continue. <laughs> the uh, little stands for Glim. Yeah, exactly, Ainoki. You've been through the will I have things before the con struggle more times than you want to think about. And we're doing things like, not just last minute, like the last of the last minutes. Like if this thing is even a day late, oh, that's, it. that's it. Thank you guys so much for like hanging in with us for this. Yeah, that's everything. Okay, I was hoping that there's like super older orders. Yeah, that would be cool. Mm, okay, we sent things, guys. Woo! I'm gonna check to see if I have an account with them and see if I have a previous. Doig, though, doig, but sleep. Yeah, I know. Uh. You can under NDA me. I just have uh, the dogs with leaflet up. Okay, here you are. gonna grab this it's not the right email or password you can always get it to email you the so to reset the password. Maybe I we did digital printing IE before. Does this work, guys? If anyone tries to scan that QR code, does that now work? Question? Yeah, that's very amazing. Thank you so much, Allah Eric, for catching that. I thought I'd just, like, we had, we'd linked the file and changed it in the linked file. So I assumed that when I updated it, it would come in correctly. And I guess it just didn't. Thank you also for testing it, Kazuhiro Samades. Thank you. Did you give up? Yeah. Give Good. Up. All right. So, Doig, plan is that you're going to try and finish up tomorrow? Yeah. Okay, awesome. Good work today, Doig. Thank you. <coughs> Good great work from you today as well. And we got stuff that we can put on our table. I don't even remember what I did. I don't remember what you did either. What? Fixes. You did, like, the back cover. Oh, thank you, Ayanoki. But I must have been doing something this morning. More substantial than... You lettered the comic. I did letter the comic today. <laughs> That's what I did. I lettered the comic today. I forgot I'd done that. Yes. <laughs> okay. That was Radical. the thing you were doing. I thought that was yesterday because it's been so long. It's been so long. It's been so long. It's been so long. Oh. New donation from a very special Phenac. Congrats, Congrats on the work you've got, got done. done. Phenac, thank you so much. <laughs> Phenac. <laughs> Phenac. I mean, it's closer to their name. Because their name is... Don't, you know, don't say the name on Twitch. Go to bed. Oh, my God. Yeah. It is. It's it's Wednesday already. All right, guys. We are go. We're leaving. Thank you so much for keeping us company. You guys are the fucking best. 
I can't believe you're still here even though we've just been NDA'd and mumbling for the past hour. You guys are so cool. Thank you for keeping us sane. Who who do you want to go to? Uh, is Enemy 64 still going? Yes, they are. They're cool. Hey, Rab. Aww. Ionoki, thank you. And thanks for all the help with the QR code as well. Hey, Rab. Rab says, congration. <laughs> thanks, <laughs> Rab. Uh, I, wanted, I really wanted to have the comic sent off tonight. Thank you, Sinister Something, for the for the gifted sub to Outlaw Eric. Enjoy enjoy your curse, Swifty, Outlaw Eric. And your worm. I know you really wanted to go tonight, dog. But put it this way, do you think you'll do a better job if you push through tonight? Or if you sleep, you sleep know, come, come through out. and look at some inspiration tomorrow and then Edit. have a day where you have, like, a full day... It just needs to be clear. It doesn't have to be the best thing ever. Mm. <laughs> what was that sound? How quickly you bounce from, I've just looked at Natalie through Drain's work. I'm tired of half-assing this. Let's go to, oh, it doesn't have to be the best thing in the world. It's fine. It just has to be clear. If I don't, then I'll spend past five o'clock. I believe in you. You already made like the bottom of that dodgeball page awesome, so I don't think it's beyond your. Ability. I think this is all right. I think this is done. This is good. What? This this panel I can't is not good. see what you're looking at. Oh, oh. You're just saying words. And Here, I'm... this one. This is good now. It's definitely better than it was. It's good. Every I can't. It's fine. It's good. You can see what's happening. We'll see how you feel about it tomorrow morning. Okay. All right, we're going. Yeah. Um, I'm gonna see if Fight is still streaming. Conflagrations. Conflagulation. A celebration. They are. All right, I'm gonna raid him. Oh, we're gonna go to sleep. I'm gonna raid him. Night night everybody. Oh we're gonna raid him. Uh bite or enemy sixty four. So we will be streaming you. again tomorrow. <laughs> is is a cool person. So we'll see you guys then. Have a great time at Bite's place. They're I making a Vipo in, in in of of sorts in, in Godot or they were. Yeah, they're making a Godot Vipo and they're making an arcade you can wander around. So okay. we'll catch you guys later. Have a great time. Fanac and until next time. Vanak, we've been going for like 16, 17 hours. <laughs> until next time. Bye. May the rest of your day be filled. How big was the gap between adventure? Hi Hi adventure. adventure. Take care, everybody. Bye bye. I have to press buttons now. Bye, everybody. Bye. Bye-bye.